Because there's always an awkward silent part where it loads in and it's like, wow, why am I even watching this? Why would I... Why would I be watching this? It's so much better if someone's talking from the get-go because then I know that I clicked on something that's not broken and like this scenario where it's just quiet at the start and then you don't know what the heck is going on. But yeah. Oh my god, I'm 10 minutes early. I'm so good at this. Mm -hmm. Hello. <sighs> this is too hard. I don't think I can do this. I might have to like just... Yeah, but I can't do that either. Because having to re-render the entire VOD every time just to cut off two minutes wouldn't work. God damn it! maybe I can edit off on YouTube. Maybe that's possible. I don't know. But yeah, hello people. <laughs> Bullish burial. Not gonna lie, I kinda like the little... I kinda like the little arm. I think it's funny. I think it looks kinda funny. Does it, like, randomly crop up, though, like the Among Us, or is it... Or is it... Triggered by something? Okay, I think it just happens on its own. I mean, it's pretty good. I think the biggest problem with this one is... I think any field that this fits with... Is a field where Among Us also... Bits, right? Field parts that resemble a hole dug up after a burial. Who is the pitiful one? The buried, the burier, or the grave digger? Wait, what? Isn't the grave digger the burier? What? I feel like they meant to say, like, who's the pitied one? The person who got buried? The person who tried to grave rob? Or, or, wait, is Gravedigger supposed to be a grave robber? Isn't Gravedigger, like... Wait, am I stupid? I might be stupid. Gravedigger, first result. Monster Jam. Gravedigger is one of the most decorated Monster Jam trucks in the world. And Anderson has won four Monster Jam World Finals Rights Reserved Championships. A person who digs graves. Yeah, but like, isn't that... Isn't the grave digger... <laughs> yeah, like... Um, I'm so confused. Well, you know what? It's fine. I'm just questioning myself with it. Wait, I... I thought that was a Hello Kitty made the base for a second there. So the music's kind of loud. That would be pretty poggers. Where's the Hello Kitty um, collaboration made the base? Green stone of magic. I stand with a green stone containing magical powers. Newly created and imbued with fresh magic, the stone radiates light and will be a force to be reckoned with in later phases. Okay, dude. That's, that's like... Pure spell counter player copium back in like... I don't know, whenever freaking spell counters started getting more support. 2008 or something? Bro, it's gonna be... It's gonna be a force to be reckoned with, bro! I was recording for something, and I played a game with this garbage, by the way, and I won the game. And this is what I won against. Oh, wait. Uh, match history. I beat this guy. He summoned Albazoa, and then he passed for 10 turns after I cleared it. And then we unmerged through later phases. Yeah, don't worry about it. In 2020, it's gonna go crazy. But right now, it's 2008, so all you get is this rock. Konami mistranslating. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's mistranslating or just like, I'm not sure if the statement makes sense, but whatever. <laughs> you don't even have the full copy pasta in there. You, you only put like one part. I would love to record duels. 
but no one at the moment likes being recorded while losing to me. Hopefully someday someone wouldn't care if they get recorded losing. I have a reputation for being good at card games and making the game not fun for my opponent because I'm too hard to beat. Also, me winning with decks doesn't help you at all because you aren't me. So you won't get the same results as me. Ultimately, until you play the decks yourself. Doesn't fit? Yeah, that's what she said. I mean, is it? Actually, I don't think she didn't say that ever, actually. That was bad, man. Oh, I didn't start the bingo. Hi, guy. <laughs> oh, Gabby shows up and I'm like, oh, yeah, I didn't start the bingo. My bad. <laughs> My bad. I forgot. At least from my experience, she's never said that. Smile. Um, imagine if, as a joke, I made bingo subscribers only. Wouldn't that be funny, guys? After all the gift subs expire next month. Wouldn't it be funny if I made bingo subscriber only? That sure would be funny, right? Why is this guy bored? This guy bored. Why is why is this guy bored? Why is this guy's bored good? Lose viewers? Do you actually think there's people? I mean, it's too early to be able to be like, Hey chat, is anyone here for that one reason? But like... Uh, sure. Oh shit, I pay life points for this. Also, this is a shit matchup for me. <laughs> he can just contact fuse me up. I don't think anyone's here for the bingo though, right? Ain't no way this anyone's here for the bingo. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. I shouldn't even have activated this, I feel like. Wait, this is the bounce one? I'm so stupid. Watch me discard it. Okay, I didn't discard it. I could have just bounced it! This card's not that bad! What am I doing? <gasps> Wait, that doesn't work. Ah, shit. Is that super poly? Wait, why am I in a dark mirror match? Bruh. <laughs> yeah, I freaking knew it. Piece of... You have a dude in the grave? Yeah, I know that, like, they had matchmaking issues at the start, but there's no shot, man. I see everybody playing dark and they're all playing mirrors. Okay, to be fair, I played against the light opponent. You know what he was playing? Actually, did I play a light, light opponent? I'm trying to think that. <laughs> I think I played one. He was playing garbage, that's what. Bro, stupid dog! You make me look bad! God damn, the stupid dog. He's playing Drytron, I think, if I played against him, yeah. <laughs> yeah, damn it, dude. Okay, I mean, this is not a real deck. I just won one game, and I got big-headed, alright? I got big-headed. I, I beat that one Dogmatica dog, and here I am. Here I am, pretending that this is a deck. Stupid dog, man. Can't believe it. Hey, good morning. You know what? Also, I realized um, people are main decking the the cute uwu virus instead. The one that um, the one that destroys small monsters, bro. I swear. Ain't no way Lil Bro is playing a dark deck against a dark deck. 
Hashtag cringe moment. Hashtag Konami! It's okay, I'll just stop taking the ritual spell and then I will surely win. There's no goddess, how will he out me? It's actually impossible to out me, there's no goddess. You know what else is dark, monarchs? Uh, not really. That's very much not true, I mean, there are three dark monarchs. And there are two dark squires, I guess. Or there's a... Are they both squires? I don't remember. But like, actually, are there three squire, dark squires? I think there's at least two. There's the Caius one, and then there's the... Um, the one that's adjacent to Idea. Or Idea. But, um... You have Caius, you have Angmar, who can recycle spells. Kind of, like, research from the grave. And then you have Delg. Who, I don't know, he sucks. That's his, that's, that's what he does. I don't remember his effect anymore. He had some garbage effect. He's literally a common or a rare in Duel Links, and he's been in the card trader in Duel Links since, like, the first year of the game. So you know he's really good. If they give him away for free in Duel Links at the start of the game, you know he's really good. <laughs> No, but main deck in Caius doesn't make sense. You shouldn't be playing against dark decks. You should be playing against light decks. That's the point of the event. Hey yo. Main deck Metabog Lobster. I'll show you a Metabog Lobster. <laughs> he did, yeah. I'm only running this because I need level 8, by the way. Because the ritual spell for this shit blows... Blows cheeks. I like, it doesn't make sense, but... Like, it's not very good. It's pretty bad. The ritual spell requires precise levels. You can use, like, Blue Eyes White Dragon from the grave. Guess what? Blue Eyes White Dragon is a light monster. Hmm. Surely he'll have a zero defense monster. I was thinking about playing this with um, the ritual dude guys. You know, the ritual dude guys. Incantations. But they only have two darks. Like the ritual and then... And then I think the monster searcher... Uh, Mandagora, Mandrake, whatever, I think is the dark one. And you can't play anything else. Like, wow, this sucks. Fringe anime arts? Wait, what? Huh? Anime arts? Where? Or what do I even go for? Guys, we need new copy pastas. We need new copy pastas. This is getting out of hand. <laughs> Who could we have a copy pasta about? I don't know. I feel like it's weird if you have it about people though, because then it looks like you're obsessed with them. I'm not obsessed with DK, neither should you be. Honestly, at this point, I would, uh... I would take the Shanghai copy pasta. I'm gonna be honest. I'm desperate here. <laughs> I'm, I'm desperate. Copy pasta tab on Discord. Channel, you mean? I don't have a channel. I feel like maybe it's worth it. The problem is, I don't think it would actively be used, right? I have, like, some copy pastas pinned, of course, but that's different. No matter how much, no matter how much of a better player you are in Strive, 
It doesn't matter, unfortunately. I don't care what anybody says or think. I am the best at this game by far! No one comes even close. Screw the mirror matchups and RPS, and good luck to everyone in top 8. How much attack does he get? 100 level? Oh god, so 800. It's so easy for him to get there. Oh no. It's okay, I won't discard the card I want. Trust. Mother! <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. I have another one. I have another one in the deck, it's fine. Damn, he's like, oh no, this guy's me, but going second. He doesn't know. Bro, this is so easy. Wait, he saw the- he saw the Chaos Max, why did he scoop? Why did he scoop? He saw freaking Chaos Max in the graveyard! Uh, wait, Tag, you literally can't do this. What? You literally are not allowed to do that emote. Not right now, anyways. Bro, I'm playing- <laughs> I'm playing a shitty Chaos Max deck, you can't use that emote. Do you not see the card in my hand? Hello? That's not allowed. That's illegal. Guys, stop posting. Stop posting Ooh, Yu Gi Oh! You're here because of Yu Gi Oh! Not because of anything else. Stop pretending. Stop posting. <laughs> but. I, I, I almost said Bon. Bon everyone! <laughs> bon everyone! Why is my brain. So scuffed. I can't speak American properly. God damn it. God damn it, man. Can't speak American. Bods, ban everyone. Muads, ban everyone. Yeah. I only speak American. That's the only language I need. This guy just activates Zombie World to get rid of it for Primeval Planet Pepega Reno. Now, if my eyes ain't deceiving me, that's exactly what happened here. That is, in fact, what took place over over yonder. Bro, you're not gonna do it. It's an 80% success rate. It's 80% success rate. Okay, let's go. Whew. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. The dogman is so dog, by the way. Wait, I should have used Suchino. Well, I guess like it doesn't really change the odds of it being discarded, but, you know. I don't know, somehow I'm like, okay, I use this one, it, it's gonna go through, trust. <laughs> it's gonna come through for me. Wait, why am I giving him really bad? You know what, frick it. Oh no, not the Mentos. Terrellement Mentos. Yeah, this is the third dark versus dark matchup. God damn it. Oh no, he's gonna get a pop. He's gonna get rid of my chaos farm, bro. Come on. I'll never summon this chaos bungus. Why? Bro. Bro. <laughs> He thinks he's popping something good. It probably would have been better for him if I kept this card instead of other shit, but whatever. Mm -hmm. 
all light players finished the event. <laughs> True, they did. I mean, to be fair, I fully intend to play mostly light because the light decks are actually more toxic and I don't want to play against them. But, <laughs> you know. Don't discard yourself, don't discard yourself, don't discard yourself, don't discard yourself. Discard the rabbit. The jackalope. Yes, Matt. Thank you, thank you. It was made by the person who decorated your house. Smile. Bro, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I should have went for the other one, to be honest, but it's okay. It's gonna... You know it wants to discard the height. Bro, what the frick? What is my opponent waiting on, by the way? Like, this? Oh no, not Zombie World! Jesus Christ. Jesus! I don't have anything. I ain't got shit, man. I hate this deck. Alright, it's fine. I'll draw into pot. It doesn't have, like, a relevant effect. I still can't attack over it. It's 1800 attack. It's too much. Wait, it didn't even proc! Oh my god... I can summon a woman, but she locks me out though, because she can't be used as Link, man. This guy Fiend, he's a beast warrior. No... <laughs> no... Alright, help me Obi-Wan Kenobi, you're my only hope. You are my only hope. Please. How free to play friendly is Master Duel right now? I haven't heard many people complain about gems. <laughs> I mean, it depends, right? In terms of, um... Like, if you're an active player, it's as good as it was before, if not better. Um... But... Like, if you're... If you're someone who tries to play it periodically, for example, it's really tough unless you come back specifically for events and then you have a deck for the event and hopefully enjoy the event. Otherwise, you know, you can't really do much. I'm disappointed at Konami because... <laughs> Complete this sentence! Hmm... I mean, I don't know. I could understand not not wanting to. I didn't watch the entirety of it, so I don't know if that's actually the case. Maybe, like maybe they led with it or something. But yeah, I I guess that's true, huh? I mean, like I could understand not wanting to uh, bring much attention to that specifically, if you're. You know, main goal is to make it a celebration of the players, but yeah, that's... that is a fair point. The fact that it didn't get raised, I... I feel like... I don't know. On, on the other hand, like, I don't know, personally... I don't know how I feel about that, actually. <laughs> they need to bring back the limit one event. That event was... Ugh. Hello. You can get gems with Solish. Yeah, I mean, it takes time. That's the thing. If people are there to play in very short bursts, they're not gonna have the time to stack up gems, right? So it's not a very good pickup game, but it's a very good as a... Um, at least semi-constant game, right? Play Ranga Turbo and Dark? I do not own Ranga and I do not plan to craft it. Well, I mean, we lose this. Also, what's the freaking. of how people say Dark? 
They're not even giving us the matchmaking that they promised. I mean, I assume I'm not going to play Light Mirrors, right? Like, that's... That's not going to happen. I, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure I'm not going to play a mirror match in this one, right? First game running stun. Oh god, please no. Snap the cable. Okay. Snap the cable. Okay. Ghost trick, bruh. I found the one ghost trick player. Oh my god! Also, I don't have my field slotted. God damn it! Wicked God Turbo. I'll show you, Wicked God. Hello. Oh no, bro. I sh I should scoop right. I should scoop. I feel like I should scoop. I'm gonna even Liam. And then I'm gonna scoop. I'm giving him the thrills, you know? I feel bad. Like, there's no shot. There's no shot. This guy... I don't wanna sack this guy. His boss monster is freaking Alucard. <laughs> There's no shot. Yeah, that's how they taught me. That's how my cousin taught me back in the day. When GOAT format was what was played, which was peak Yu-Gi-Oh, by the way. I missed that video. So good. Okay. Can I go to format deck beat Ghost Trick? I mean, a lot of modern decks could lose to a Goat format deck, assuming that they brick in the correct way. Right? Depends on the deck, obviously, how many Garnets, etc. Like, relatively unuseful cards they have, but. It is possible to lose with like a good deck against the uh, goat for Manda. Mm -hmm. Some exes fit really well into goat format. True. Some of them really do fit really well into goat format. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay, what was this guy? Now I need to see. What are these guys playing? Are these Rongo gamers? What is happening? Like, what, what, what are these guys doing? Are... Bro, how? Did they, how did they fuck up so bad? Bro, what the fuck do you mean? <laughs> I'm only playing mirror matches. How did they fuck it up? It's only mirror matches! I'm playing dark, I'm only playing against dark decks. I'm playing light, I'm playing against mostly light decks. What do you mean? <laughs> That's so bad. Holy shit. I don't understand. How did they do that? Like, I'm not mad. I'm just so confused. How did you do that? Also, is this cheap? This might be like a good cheapo deck for people, right? Yeah, this is pretty cheap. Tag, you can play this deck. You don't even have to invest anything. Like all commons and rares. And then like three blois with dragons, which I'm pretty sure you crafted a blois at the start of the game, didn't you? <laughs> so there you go. Da -da, da -da. Yeah, yesterday it was an unrelated replay. 
where I saw this and I realized, oh yeah, this is also legal for the event, isn't it? It was like a replay from half a year ago in DC Cup or something. Oh no, he made me go first. Oh no, no. Heronix, uh oh. What's the worst that could happen? Am I right, guys? I should have kept Armand, maybe, or I mean, uh, Vadis, but no. Oh. You're not playing Skull Servants? Can you even play Skull Servants probably? Maybe you can. Do you have a list? I do have a zombie account. It doesn't have like everything, but... Oh my god, bro. I freaking knew it. <clears throat> oh my goodness. We can begin our ritual. Thank you for the raid, the Dell. Nefroth? No, 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 no. I'm Bifroth. Welcome. I'm just over here enjoying a very good time in the event. Hope you had a good rest of your stream. Nerd raid? Well, hello, nerds. Welcome. Is this Dell's choice? Like, are, are you raiding a nerd or are you the nerds? That's the question, though. That's what I want to know. Are you guys the nerds or am I the nerd? Demand collabs? Uh-oh. 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 Uh, okay, we can uh, play um, the Roblox Yu-Gi-Oh, yeah. I mean, we could probably figure something out. Light versus light. Wait, you're right, bro! How? It's so scuffed, I swear to god. I've played one intended matchup only. Bruh, what is this? What the frick is this? Oh my god, my extra deck is already kind of empty. How are you? You're using dark? Well, I hope you enjoy those mirror matches. I'm good, I'm good. I've played like one intended matchup. I've played... Three games dark versus dark. And... And I've also played uh, three games light versus light. That's pretty cool. Baldur's Gate 3, I need another male party to screw- Bro, okay. That game is like 1 million hours. There's no shot we're ever gonna complete that. That's too big of a commitment. You're... That's like you asking me to marry you. That's... I don't know if you realize the question. <laughs> it's too much. Unlimited content. I mean, you're not wrong. I have the out. I have the out. Yeah, you are. That's why I want you to find someone better. Smile. I'm just not ready for the commitment, you know? Are you running some based anti-dark cards in there? Nope, I'm... I am... playing Exo Sisters, that's it. And I'm playing one of Drowning Mirror first, because it would be very funny if it resolved. Can you Dark Cavalry... Freaking god, dude. Can you Dark Cavalry and Runic? Uh, I mean, yeah... 
tactics. You have to be playing the dark runic though, which means you're playing the dog. <laughs> I mean, like, you can do it, I don't think you want to do it, but... Oh my god, I should have just destroyed his shit and said... I don't know, I mean... I reckon that Dimensional Fissure is good against most decks. Man, this sucks. Not that it, like, changes much, right? But why the frick is it so many mirror matches? Like, how did... How did they heck it up? That's so weird to me. Honestly, like... They could have just not said that it's supposed to be light versus dark most of the time. And then I wouldn't have to complain about it or anything, <laughs> you know? I wouldn't have to comment about it. But yeah, I don't think most uh, anti-type or anti-attribute cards are available anymore, to be honest. I think the glitch was early on in the day when you wouldn't find anyone. Now they just turned it on, probably fricked it up, they said, heck it, let's just make it normal matchmaking, and that's what's happening, I reckon. That is actually probably exactly what's happening. They just fricked it up, and then they turned it on normal mode. Enable normie mode. Oh, I can't draw right. <laughs> Wait, that's the loop? It's already looping? Bruh. Oh boy. <clears throat> why, why in the main phase? I'm not even done setting! Bro, why are you sniping? What the frick, dude? I wasn't even done setting this guy's like, okay, I'm going to get rid of Returnia. What the frick, man? What is that? <laughs> what do you mean? Bruh. God damn it. God damn it. It's a gun like Okay, I mean, at this point, I feel like it's kind of wasteful to keep saying it, but like, come on, man, what is this? It keeps happening. Wow, I guess like the hand trap mission though, for bingo, is really easy to hit for people now. Like, getting hit by the same hand trap? Pretty easy to get. Uh, I can show you the decklist afterwards. I didn't actually take a screenshot, but... I mean... I kind of just threw together something hastily to play with Neg earlier... ...during the week when we were trying out decks. Makes Crossout easier. What do you mean easier? Like, Crossout was completely unplayable before. Assuming that you play mirror matches, though, I guess it's kind of playable. Oh, wait, we did have two surrenders in a row as well. <clears throat> yeah, we did, we did, we did. Bone Heimer. No, I don't think I will. This monster wanders the seas, sucking dry any creatures it may encounter. No, I don't think I will. I don't think I will, thank you very much. Yep, it is light against light. It 
that's okay. I only have to be worried about uh, Imperium, right? Because dark decks don't have uh, hand traps that are relevant, right, guys? Haha. <laughs> Isn't that right? That's so right. Oh my god. How far am I in Fontaine? Actually, weirdly enough, I did play a little bit of Genshin today. And I unlocked two of the statues of uh, Seven. Yes, two of them. Uh, but that's it. That's all I did. <laughs> and I did dailies real quick. <clears throat> but I'm not very far. I... S I only did like 10% of that extra desert area that leads to Fontaine or whatever, right? So... You know, I'm... I've been really interested in the story gaming part. I don't know, I mean, I talked about it on the stream before. In theory, I do want to play, but it's also like... I kind of don't feel like it, you know? It's like, uh, I don't know, man. Most of my Genshin gaming over the last few years has been when I'm listening to a stream, and I'm like, okay, I'll play some Genshin, I guess, because it's like a Saturday or something. Like, log in, maybe, if I remember, I do the dailies, I don't spend my resin because I've been capped since, like, two years ago or something. Like, AR-60. Yeah. You know, that's... <laughs> that's pretty much it. Oh, to be fair, that's true. That is true. The freaking uh, oh, I should have recycled this. I only have one left. Shit. Um. Oh, I could have dodged it entirely, couldn't I? Why not do that? I remember I was trying to do some sort of an event quest. And then walking through the main hub in Sumeru, I freaking triggered like four separate story quests while I was walking around the city. And then I couldn't progress the quest because characters were involved in every single one of those story quests. So I had to do like four character quests before I could advance the thing that I was actually playing for. It's like, bro, are you kidding me? Why is this happening to me? That this guy's pogging off cattle call rank up magic. That's kind of... That's actually kind of good for him, isn't it? Am I able for playing Drytrons in this? I mean... Again... The main thing that matters is your enjoyment, I guess, right? There are worse things to play, I, <laughs> I will say this. There are worse things to face. Hello. How to call is a three of staple and Rage Raptors. I didn't know that. I don't think I've ever seen anyone use Cattle Call and Raid Raptors before because they were just turboing out Call Yuga anyways. Do you use it in that as well? I don't know, maybe it's coincidence. What? Wait. Wait. <laughs> wait. Oh, it's because it's the other side, right? Oh wait, this is a proper matchup. He's playing Dark. I was like, wait a minute, why is this why is this guy playing some banned card? It's like, oh yeah, right, it's just a dark monster, right? <laughs> wait, this guy's cheating! This is supposed to be light monsters versus light monsters only. Does he have any backer removal guys? Am I safe in sacking this guy with drowning mirror first? That's my main question. Does he have removal? Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely see how uh, Cattle Call could be nice. 
Well, I'm glad that he didn't go Ultimate Falcon because that card can't be drowning. Fortress Falcon is unaffected. This guy? You see? Bro, why do they have so many unaffected cards? Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I have anything to out this shit with. Yeah, you, you know, you, you have fun. You have fun, dude. Yeah, well, he has the material, so... It don't matter. <laughs> I have this guy. I have this guy. Bro, he's playing two Arsenal Falcon. That's a UR as well. I have this guy. I have this guy. And I don't have this guy. So I'm missing three URs. Okay, I'm missing five URs for this. I don't think I'm playing this shit. Yeah, he's playing 60 cards. Dark heroes can legally summon Contrast Hero Chaos, Paga. We love Contrast Heroes. You're not allowed to play the deck the way you want to play it. You're only allowed to play it one way. My way. Or get out of here. I didn't buy your cards for you so you would play them different ways. I'm pretty sure that person is only playing the deck because they want to meme around with, a, with an otherwise unplayable archetype, so... Bro, stop! Uh, I'm playing light so I don't have to play against light decks because they're so annoying to play against! Oh my god, I hate it here! <laughs> this is actually the worst. Bruh! <laughs> this is horrible. This is actually horrible. <sighs> Mother truck, this is what I'm trying to avoid. Uh, it's pretty poggers that you can plus off of Nibiru. The only problem is that you're plussing off into garbage carts, so, you know, that's... That's the one issue with Ferratic. I mean, it doesn't have to be stun, it could be runic anything. It could be literally anything! <laughs> Got nibbed by a Numeron player earlier, they lost because they couldn't remove the nib token, oh no. Rather than Nibiru itself, then. Wait, but wouldn't they play Kaijus as well so they could get rid of the big token that you potentially keep in defense and then they crash into it and then they can do stuff again? I don't know. I feel like that's kind of. This is your idea of fun. This is why you came here.
Yeah, I know, that's what I'm saying. If they play... If they play the light kaijus, they have over 3,000 attack, they could crash it into the token if you keep it in defense. Bro... Fun, fun little match. I'm gonna be honest, like, if I was watching a stream on the side, I would probably drag this out as long as possible just because fuck this guy. But I'm kind of streaming, so I feel like that's probably not the right approach. It's probably not the right approach. event already <laughs> holy shit how is everything broken like i i thought okay at least i can choose which toxic decks i have to deal with right at least i have the power to say i don't want to play against this shit no they all freak up their own matchmaking where the only way to fix it is to just turn on the standard matchmaking gems. Uh-oh, we're playing Dark ma The Dark Magician! That man, you're playing loner, or you're playing against loner, I assume. It's probably the Cyframe Ladybug Cybers combo deck. BAM! Yep. Yep. Alright, we get a search. Nice. Send her back. Royal Dark Magician Girl. Royal. Uh oh, they have the field spell that allows them to quick synchro. No, we summoned a card which allowed them to activate an effect. No. Zeta. Well, we don't have lethal now. No, oh, the classic mistake doing anything against Sir Frames. No. The oldest trick in the book. And we're an amp through. Get out of my life. Ooh. No, why did we risk it? Bam. Oh, Sir Frames is so good. Dance if you want it. Dance if you want it tonight. Dance if you want it. Dance if you want it tonight. Oh wait, wait, no, 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 we're not going to ranked. I don't want to play scare close, it's fine. True, it was for the animation. You know what, I respect that. I mean, attacks are also risky, I guess, in a way, right? Because they have the anti-attack one as well. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Also, you got more dual assessment points. Eh? Smart. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Bets. Do you think my opponent's playing a light or a dark deck? I've had one properly matched opponent, or two properly matched opponents so far today. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
dance if you want it. Dark. I mean, he's on 60 cards, I guess, right? Oh, he left. Dance if you want it tonight. Wait, did I get a... No. Oh, okay, this... I. There's no shot this is real, right? This number, by the way. Like, what, 55 million points? You're telling me there's a hundred million points obtained? And you get a hundred points per... Or, I guess, like, 150 points are distributed per average in the game, right? So it's like, what, 666,000 duels that have been played today? At the very least, if we don't count scoops? There's no shot, right? Or, wait, does it go down? The frame has got us? I mean, every light deck has got us. Wait, what? Why would it go down? Oh, you mean like personal VSP? No, I don't think you lose points. No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I totaled the... both sides. Like you, 150 points because one person wins, other person loses. That would be like 666,000-ish duels. In the first half of a day. There's no shot. Th th that has to be a fake number, right? <laughs> like, they just put up a random number. There's no shot. Yeah, may maybe it's the bots, you know what? I that I would believe, actually. I could see that being the case. If you want it. Dance if you want it tonight. Dance if you want it. Dance if you want it tonight. I'm moving. Dance if you want it tonight. <laughs> True. Guys, make sure to invest in DLM coin. Look at the value. Oh, I can't draw again. God damn it. Frick mother. I keep forgetting. <laughs> Man, pot is so bad. Why is everyone... Or not everyone. Why is anyone playing it? Weird champ. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have not played any bots. But I mean, admittedly though, I think it does still, you know, try to match you up against, um... More, pl like, plus minus your own rank, right? As it did before. For the last several events now. So maybe if they're all in, like, silver, bronze or something. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Your newest royal? Uh, don't think I did. Oh, it's the. <laughs> I see. I see. Wait, what is that effect again? What is he doing? You can send this card. If I get one face of monster opponent controls, send one black wing synchro. Or if you do lose attack and negated, yeah. Okay, I thought you needed to have a dude on the field to do that, but I guess that's for quick effect. You want it? Oh. Okay. Cool. But I did get 110 points. What the frick? Wait. So what, if you're on a streak, you get more points? Is there someone on like a 100 game win streak that's getting like 1,000 points? There's John VSP points, who's getting like 1 million points per win. On either side, and that's why the points are so high.
One more trailer? Hey, listen, he's trying his darndest. Huh? Bro, oh, I don't want to play against Strunek. Is that what you're looking up, Aceton? Hmm. against dry turn five times in a row that sounds really fun has anyone been uh wrong out yet though that's the question <laughs> i'm waiting for someone to enter chat and be like dude i got wrong out <laughs> yep i've had more light and dark mirror matches than i have proper matches My speculation is that early on they had matchmaking errors where it wouldn't match people up correctly because probably there weren't that many people on at the time or something. I don't know. Um, they might have, they might have uh, kind of fricked up. <laughs> they might have just said frick it and uh, turned on standard matchmaking in this. So it's RNG whether you, you know, face the opposite side or if you're just playing a mirror match. Bit of a bit of a thing, you know. Go for prosp search. I don't think I do right now. Frick it. Too lazy to search for anything. <laughs> I don't feel like searching for anything. But you know what? Frick it. I'm gonna set it as a bluff. I'm not unhinged. You are unhinged. God, dude, pot of greed, that card shouldn't be legal. Turn two, no attack. <clears throat> I used evenly match. That's the way how I got rid of his board. He trying to bait exactly. <laughs> oh no, not dimensional fissure. No. All right, guys, by the end of the stream, I want to see the light percentage be at exactly 50. It needs to be perfectly balanced. Hashtag team light. Hashtag... No, actually, I can't say that. 
I, well, I mean, what do you want him to do? He's scooping anyways, he can't do anything. The sand's not very good, but I won't. Team Neff? No. I hate Neff. Harold for president? If that's what it takes. <laughs> Do we know, like, what... Have they announced that they're doing anything for the winning side? Like, we're getting... Dark Magician or Blue Eye Sleeves Bat Chest? Or is this just, you know, one of those things where they're... They didn't really think it through and they're like, ah, it's fine, let's just have some sort of a percentage. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter in that sense. It's not about it being like a big reward for the winning team. It's more so like everybody gets something. Just it's decided by whichever side wins, right? That's how they've done it in the past. Da, da, da. Hello. It's not that you can change sides, you're like encouraged to change sides with the missions. I mean, you don't need the title, like, hello, titles suck anyways. I mean, realistically, that's probably what's happening. Unfort. Unlucky there, it didn't open better, but... Well. Well, I mean, they're slowly starting to win secret packs, so it's probably gonna happen sooner or later. Where the heck is the speedroid stuff being added to the game? It's not that I need it, like, I have almost all of it. I'm missing, like, one card that I can just craft anyways. But I feel like it's kind of ridiculous that it's still there. Bro, this man opened multiple quick launch. Okay. Is this a loner? Or maybe it's Kal Yuga Turbo Monk Giga. Maybe it's a proper deck. Does anyone know? Is this the loner? I mean, blockings are cheap though. You get the structure, and then you're missing like. Outside of staples, like, three to four yours. I don't think it's that bad. <laughs> but most- I don't think I agree. You need- to be able to do more than just the black ring summons. Uh. Okay, you want the level eight, then probably well depends on the build, but you might want the nine your as well. And then obviously you need the double summon guy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I 
Yeah, I mean, most loners aren't looking too crazy. Eh? Bro, okay, this is not a loner, I guess. Yikes. Or is it? Um, it's so good, like, if you're playing it with a Tirlemon deck, it's really nice. <laughs> I really don't like how the field looks kind of nice, but these, like, slash effects or whatever look really, really bad. I, I feel like they aesthetically don't match the, the field at all. They look like clip art. <laughs> Clip art or something. Yeah, like being able to mill is nuts. <laughs> Okay. Sure. Mm -hmm. Song is Marry Me from Dreams Come True. And, uh, but you might recognize the backing track being basically Green Hill Zone from the same composer. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, the <laughs> that happens, sorry. It scrolls by if there's like a lot of spaces in the title, it can happen. Mm, I mean, that wasn't just off of one trap, to be fair. He shuffled, so I was safe to go. I was safe to go ahead there. Okay, we'll switch accounts and decks after this, went, the next one, I think. Like, if I only had, uh, only the trap card and he had the shuffle, then I would have been in trouble because, you know, he could prevent me from going to an XCs or shuffled XCs, potentially. Well, it depends if I have the banish, then not really, but you know what I mean. Could have been weaker. When are loner decks so unplayable? Because when they're playable, the game is bad. <laughs> clearly, that's, clearly that's the problem. I don't know, they... To be honest, I have no clue who they leave... You know, the creation of the loner decks to, but... They leave it to weird people, I can say that much usually, at least.
I don't think we win this one. They already have the... That's called the uh, tryout duel event. We had that a week ago. Last Friday through last Sunday was that event exactly. I think less variety wouldn't make it better, to be honest. I have talked about loner-only events as a possibility, but in that case I need to have a pretty large roster of decks. And they can't be, you know, like just objectively better or worse than the other ones. I feel like these normal events, they would might have to even switch up the roster at some point. Like mid midway through the event. But the the problem would be I feel like it's really hard to achieve a balance where it's not easily, you know, just dominated by one specific deck. I feel like the trial one wasn't dominated by Valence mostly because people just don't want to read any of the decks, so they mostly went for the Chaos one. And also it was a very short event. If it was longer and people needed to grind it longer, I think it would have just been, you know, go second Valence turbo most of the time. Because that was the best deck for OTK. And all of them had really shit turn ones. Different owners every day. Yeah, that could help too. Wow, this looks really playable. <laughs> Bro, I don't want to play against light decks. That's why I'm playing light side. <laughs> why the frick? God damn it. I mean, what's the point of any event? Well, I mean, exosisters don't need help. Fine. Oh boy. And would you look at that, it's another light deck. Hopefully I don't get ogred. That would suck. Or yammed after, <laughs> after the fact, actually. Actually, maybe someone knows. Um, talking of Joel. Uh, I know that the Hearthstone guy... A Hearthstone guy made like content out of... So I tried Yu-Gi-Oh! Because last time I couldn't figure anything out because it's such a mess. And now I tried it again to see if it's possible. Um, and apparently far far reacted to it and now they're gonna like have a quote-unquote discussion I don't know I I'm kind of skeptical to be honest about how fruitful that is but I guess it depends on how 
how pure the motivations for either side are. Uh, is there actually drama or is it just like... Rather, yeah, I guess, like, are, is my... Are my expectations real or what? Like, is there drama or is it just like... Hey bro, I want you to understand why I, as a Yu-Gi-Oh player, like the game and I want to explain things that you misunderstood. Hello. Hello. Who ran ran? He's a heart stoner. I mean, I feel like it's kind of ridiculous to... You know, you can't really dismiss most people's interpretation of the situation either whenever they try to start playing uh, a game like Yu-Gi-Oh. It's very unwelcoming, so, you know, whatever their feelings are, they, they are true for them. You can, like, offer help, but that's the most you can really do. Oh my god, this guy has cards to extend for days. I mean, it's also not... It's not friendly to older players either. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh is just a mess in a lot of ways, unfortunately. Zexal Sage. Um. Plus, ain't safe, you may caught your name on any YouTube video noob using MST to negate and lower it. I mean, that doesn't matter, though. I don't think, to be honest, that Yu-Gi-Oh! really has that big of a... Um, that big of an audience for... making fun of newbies' content. Like, I know that it exists, obviously, because the game is very complicated, but... I don't think that's, like, a very active issue for most people. Ooh, that might be a problem. I maybe needed to go for her, even though I didn't want to. Oh boy. Oh no! I'm screwed. Well, actually, not entirely. But we're pretty close to being screwed, though. Jabroni. Agree with Randran? Agree on what, though? What is- what is his thesis? What is his statement? That's what I'm asking you guys, like, what- what even is the content of the situation? Isn't it just the guy made a video of like, Ooh, I'm trying to play Yu-Gi-Oh again because last time it didn't work out and now he's like, Oh, well, it still didn't work out for me or something. Yeah. I feel I just don't have the information, you know? I'm lacking critical information. Hey, potato. I like Hendo's statement, though. That's a good one. I think it's hard. I mean, it is. It's very inaccessible, which is a big problem. Yeah, but that's like, I feel like that's a statement that's kind of a whatever statement, you know? 
it's obviously inherently true. Complexity does not equal fun. But whether the game is boring or not comes down to the individual. So it's like... You know, like, he's not wrong. But I wouldn't say that his opinion should be something that you have to agree or, or not agree or disagree with, but like potentially combat with or against if you don't agree with it. There's like a lot of things that I don't find fun that people love. Having to get a coach to learn the game like Chad was suggesting wasn't something he liked about the game because other games like Hearthstone didn't require it to learn the basics. I mean, you don't require a coach either. It just depends, right? I, to be fair, though, there is the argument of being a streamer puts you in a position where you are more able to get a coach and whatnot. But on the other hand, I think you could make the argument that being a streamer also also puts you in a position where you might be more expected to perform well at a game, especially if it's a multiplayer game. Which means, you know, your expect or not expectations, not only your expectations, but also the expectations put on you from the audience could alter your ability to enjoy the game. Like in other ways, right? Coach for Yu-Gi-Oh! Just play whatever and how you like. Yeah, I mean, you can do that, but you can't do that when you have like 2,000 people in your chat shouting at you how, like, no, you're supposed to do it this way. I mean, you still can, but it can be harder, right? I, get, I just continued to play Master Duel because I found so many fun streamers who taught me about the game. That does help, yeah. And a lot of... Think of all the random games that didn't have that content side help, you know? They didn't have the communities on YouTube, on Twitch, etc. Facebook Gaming. <laughs> Hashtag Zuckerberg. Uh, and then they died. Oh shit, wait, I searched for the wrong card. I, I don't have lethal. <laughs> I, I didn't realize I banished my women. I banished my double women. Oh no, not my women. No, not the women. God damn it. Artifact? I think Artifact did have an audience. Like, it had a pretty big audience at first, it's just they didn't... Like, that That one was more... I think that one was more, you know, Valve's problem. Or whoever was the actual... The actual... Masterminds behind that game. Act first was playing Legacy of the Duelist without Link. Yeah, I mean, if you have the drive, like obviously you can learn it as well. You miss artifact on Twitch? No. Not artifact on Twitch. Wait, wait. <laughs> I was like, wait, his life points are kind of low. He can go for Utopia, right? But it's fine, I have Ogre. Oh my god. That scared me for a moment. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. No, admittedly, Utopia Double would have made more sense now. Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold up. 
Uh oh. <laughs> Wait just a moment now. Am I fine still? I'm not sure if I'm fine. You're just gonna Zeus. We don't know- what do you mean? There's always someone who plays Utopia in chat. Oh my god, why is there an effect? Wait, what? Oh, I was just summoning two, I guess. I mean, that's fine, right? Wait, actually, maybe... Hmm, this might be a problem. That was kind of scary. Do I have Martha's left though? It might be kind of screwed so. Or not Martha's, but Michaela's side. Whew! Good, we good. Yeah, I was I thought he was using some sort of a destruction effect, like post-destruction trigger. Also I didn't realize that this isn't like uh drug Lubion. Like other cards can attack, they just can't attack directly. Okay. Well, I mean, I, I knew the... <laughs> well, yeah, that's true. You, I thought maybe it's some other effect that I've never read. Exactly. That's exactly that. <laughs> that's exactly what I was wondering about. Damn, I'm like halfway through for the light one. And I'm half done as well. I really want you to complete it, huh? What's the overall title? Harnesser of Chaos. A title given to duelists who have achieved results by harnessing a chaotic mixture of light and darkness. Having understood these two conflicting attributes traits, you have taken a first step into the abyss. No, I haven't. Hello, Lee. First step into a biz download master? Wait, you're right. Oh baby, it feels so good to clear eight daily missions in one in one event day. This this is Rocket League. No, this is this is daily farming.
<laughs> that clip is in my mind. I can't. It lives rent free in my mind. Uh, what text did I have this? Oh yeah, I had um, church. Sure. We have like a couple options on this actually. Off our dark though, because I don't think I want to play the runic muskets. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, technically it is an option on the account. I don't think I want to do it, but... If they force me to, I might have to resort to it. I might have to resort to playing Vendra. Yeah, that's only that's only if they, you know, make give me the bad matchups. No. Do I wanna go first? I mean I guess I wanna go first. It's good that they give light and darkness dragon sleeves. Yeah, they're pretty nice. I think the cosmetic part is definitely pretty cool. Oh no, frickin' Medusa. Much better. Imagine I had the wrong card, that would never happen, haha. I might banish this guy, not gonna lie. But I could also wait. You know what? Freaking, I'm gonna wait. Yeah, we're kind of balling. Yeah, I'm balling. What about it? I feel like maybe I want to buy the Foolish Burial Graveyard for my account that has the um, the desert field because you know it's it's kind of arid earth so the overlap there is kind of nice it might look good together. Or is there unchained man? <laughs> There's so many mates that are missing. When was the last time we got a mate actually? Wait, are we getting a mate from this battle pass? I don't even remember. I've been so unhyped about mates in a long time that I actually don't remember. Oh, DD Ghost was the last one, right? Yeah, DD Ghost was the last one. Okay, that one sucked ass, I'm gonna be honest. The preview for it looked okay. I was fine with it not having a lot of, um... Not having a lot of, um... You know, animations or anything, but the fact that you don't even see the cat in the crystal is just pathetic. Like, that's so bad. Yeah, it's probably the, the gamma from past. Uh... Yeah, Hanzo was leaked. I don't know, though. We need so much more. Okay, but like you should be able to see it on occasion because I can tell you for a fact that the cat is not in that crystal, okay? Wait, the song's name is Inted. Is there another meaning to that word? Is I don't, <laughs> I don't think there is.
bro, you just entered. Yeah, it's very uncommon to queue into the correct attributes. Hello. Okay, but like, out of all the ad, <laughs> all the archetypes to scoop to on activation, is Evil Eye really one you would scoop to? I guess it's because he saw that I had a play. Uh... Yeah, they fricked it up. They fricked it up. By the way, I can't believe they still haven't changed the selector here. You can't like click on a card and drag to the side like you could in Duel Links and PC Duel Links. I really hate that I'm used to slow scrolling like this. Like I know you can drag this tiny little thing, but it's so annoying. Like, why can't I just click on the card? Having to precise, pre precision click just wastes so much time. You've liked your one? I guess it is. I'm not really good into Kaiju's here, unfortunately. God, that sounds so bad. That sounds even worse. Yikes. Imagine he red rebooted me here. That would have been really funny. I'm the one thing I miss from the event, the labyrinth event. Is people red rebooting my freaking retribution, not getting an effect off of it, and then they just scooped. It was so good. That was like the one redeeming feature of that event. Ubisoft are in a bad choice. I mean, anything that's a good go second OTK deck is very viable. Uh, well, bingo or is rejoice, I guess. Oh, I guess this still counts. Uh, I mean, I'll summon it because it's indestructible at least, right? Burn cubics? Uh, I think they are either all light or mixed. I'm not sure though. Someone probably knows better. I feel like Vgem is a dark. And also, they have some. Some of the burn guys are wind and fire now. But I think most of the good cards are like. Why did the was that just for this? Just is it wait, is this a burn deck? Wait, Monka Okay. I mean I'm going to assume that with two just desserts it's probably a burn deck. Hello. Thank for the follow. Bad luck blast. I'll show you a bad luck blast, buddy. Mm, I think I just win like this, right? Yep, 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 yep. I 
good ones are dark, but these guys light. Oh, okay, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how viable it is, though. But... Is Kaluga banned? No, Kaluga Turbo is one of the theoretically better dark decks. I have 35, I can go up to 4k, if I bounce I can go a bit higher I guess. Oh wait, shoot. I didn't even have to do this, whoops. I mean I, I still win but... Here's a cool dual links loop you can do. The Medusa loop, you can recycle the bounce and then if you have an equip on a different Medusa or a different card, you can bounce an opponent's monster and your own monster and then recycle it. Oh my god, that's so broken. However, could anyone defeat this? How could they ever do that? That's crazy. Light machine, wait, it's a machine? Damn. I love that they forced me to choose which which one of these manager effects to start with. Like, it's fine that they give you the choice, but just as with the shuffling, I feel like in this situation, if you click no, it should just randomly do it, right? There's not really any reason why it wouldn't do that. White duel just for us is not fair. Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> What do you mean? Oh yeah, that I don't see it in wide mode? <laughs> well, I yep. mean, I can pretend that I'm looking at it through OBS. How would you even- how do you imagine it would work? If I saw it in wide mode as well. I physically stretched the game out. Thank you for the gifts of Corpy uh, and Mehi. Because I already have a uh, normal slain, I'm gonna grab a Gorgoneo for next turn follow up as well. And the discard so that I have the ability to search for whatever I want off of an evil eye discard, assuming that I get one, but you know. I think there's a decent shot that I will get one. Definitely could make an argument for field spell search, potential recycle, better target, etc., but yeah. Really fine. Yo, you should gamma this. Well, now you shouldn't get mad anymore. What the heck was that? Chaos Hunter? Alright, well, that's kind of annoying actually. like going for his decks that are super busted since there's less hand traps. Uh, I would say going second decks are more busted, to be honest, in these events usually. Because you're less likely to be able to set up a board that's actually really impervious to a lot of board breaking.
Ah, frick it, let's do it. My follow-up ability is gonna be a little bit restricted, but... Uh... Oh. Oh no, yeah, yeah, that's fine, because it's requested. Okay. No chance. I was like, thinking, wait, does the banish proc it? But no, no, no. It's the same thing. Drew three Ellison's starting hand twice in this event. You know what, maybe, uh, have you ever considered that you deserve that happening? Have you ever thought that maybe it's you? I just want to say you have some of the cutest emotes I've seen. Wow, that's very kind of you. Thank you, thank you. Hello. Thank you for the follow as well. See, guys, you should be more like cookies, okay? <laughs> I need more, more positive encouragement. I do need to get a new batch made though we need the new batch we need new stuff it's so hard though when you're a mascot less dumbo like me <laughs> often do i stream i stream like five times a week sometimes even more i stream too much too much for anyone's good that's the objective true answer Hello. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. One hundred percent win streak. I mean, do you you want the win loss count? We're currently like three and one, I think. I lost the first game and then we streaked afterwards. If you care. <laughs> if you care. You like cards that are cute as well. They are. I mean, I really like Evil Eyes. It's one of those archetypes that... I feel like should probably get more support as well, but... It's such a small archetype, it's kind of wild, though. Oh, well, we're gonna blind pop a card, dude. First game was just practice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it wasn't even... Correct matchup. We were dark versus dark, I think. Actually, were we? No, it was... <laughs> Wait, no. I'm trying to think. The last game that I remember distinctly where I wasn't more focused on trying to read chat was uh, when we were playing Exosisters and I played against the Herald plus F-Zero Turbo. That's the last game that's actually imprinted in my memory. Let's see. What is our match history? Oh no, wait. We actually are 100% win rate on this. Damn, this deck is too good. First opponent was, oh yeah, it was this tier guy who scooped, and we played against this guy. We kind of played against us, but then he lost. And he played against this guy, and he got sacked, yeah. Damn, Evil Eye broke, and... Mr. the 22k title is Harasser of Kit, what the monkey eggs. The idea behind is actually interesting as well. Yeah, that's true. I... Where's the Evil Eye lore? Wait, where's my solo get? Honestly though, I, I say this and then I instantly think... Maybe it's better if they don't give us a gate for archetypes that I like because... It's always disappointing. Like, it's almost always so disappointing. I don't want to be disappointed no more. Hey guys, do you play versus the other element, or is it possible? Um, you very commonly match up against the same attribute as yourself. You were supposed to mainly be playing against opposite uh, attribute, but they fricked something up, and now it's more common to be light versus light and dark. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, I mean... I wouldn't be surprised if they were underpaid, to be fair. Uh, I think we keep Basilius. I don't really need to send anything right now. I guess I'm committing all of this. I mean, I have one to get, right? Should be fine. Getting good hands. I've, I've actually been getting good hands the entirety of the time with this deck. I don't think we've had like a single unplayable evil eye hand. Deck is too good. Smile. Oh, should I have deck list on? I guess I'll put deck list. This deck is like... I don't know. The, I feel like this one's even more awkward in the sense that it's not bad. It's not crazy, but it's also too expensive to be like, yeah, you should build this. Like, oh, it's only five URs. What show is your favorite, and what character from that show is your favorite? Oh my god, you're, you're hitting me with the very tough questions. When people ask me about favorites, most of the time, I give them a really boring answer over and over, where it's like, I really struggle picking favorite things in general. I mean, assuming that show in this case also includes anime, I usually just say Samurai Champloo or or uh, Cowboy Bebop because it's like, oh yeah, that makes sense. That's a good series. But sometimes I wouldn't feel that way. <laughs> hey streamer, I'm going to the grocery store. I need anything while you're out? Um, I mean, if there's some good cherries while there's still any in the stores, that could be nice. Maybe some more fruit. Uh, some rice. One good thing about Evil Eye is that danger. Oh, I forgot to screenshot the deck. No! Cherry tomatoes? I actually have cherry tomatoes, though. Cherry tomatoes are a staple for me. <laughs> the good stuff. Thank you, thank you. Where's my evenly matched, bro? I've been evenly like three times. I mean, I did also have a counter trap for them every single time, but where's my evenly matched, bro? Oh no. The sun's not great. <laughs> Do I even run evenly? I should probably play it if I don't. It's kind of nice. I've been vibing the whole album. Kind of cool. What is he waiting for? You don't have Ash, what are you... Is he actually considering to solemn this or something? Monkers. I don't even know. Might be more back row focus, so monsters might be more of a commodity for me. Played versus a guy that used pure light swords, pure 2006. Oh my god, that sounds kind of pog actually. Mm, I don't know if I agree with that one. I feel like Celestia is a better card these days. I don't know though. I, I felt that way even before, so I'm just too biased. I guess. Mm, I guess I'm still gonna go counter trap. I was thinking, searching for the archetype 
the archetype um, MSD, but I don't think it's gonna be as good. Icarus attack. Wait, is this Black Wings? Oh my god, it is. Bruh, this guy's playing like. <laughs> this man is on. This man is on some sort of a Edison Blackwing decklist. Who are you even playing called by? Who are you, what are you planning to hit? I mean, I guess if you're playing dark, it makes more sense, right? Because you should be playing against the hand trap light decks, but... Oh my god. Well, I guess that's a bingo for you guys as well. I don't remember if there's been a limited one card so far. But what the f- <laughs> Come on, man! Let me have something! God damn it. God damn it. Oh yeah, this happened too. Damn, this guy's so rude. Hey, good morning. Oh, I'm just having fun in the event, I guess. Are you actually kidding? Bruh, what the... F Are you kidding me? Huh? How do you sub using Amazon Prime? Uh, if you have Prime, you can link it on Twitch. I think it's twitch.tv slash Prime or Prime Gaming or something. Yeah, if you do twitch.tv slash Prime, it redirects you. And then you basically get a free token to sub with- Bro, I can't do anything! I need an evil eye monster on the field! Oh my god, I'm actually dead. Well, maybe I'm not dead this turn, but... Bruh. Yikes, that's kinda scary. I mean, it's not- I don't, I don't think he's the luckiest player in- Like, he could have had a better board, for sure. It's just kind of insane that he had the double called by into cross out as well. <laughs> like, that's kind of nutty. Also, nice royal, though. Damn, that's clean. That's really clean. But yeah, you get a free token that allows you to sub to any stream. Um once a month. Usually people like using that- well, it depends on who you are, but a lot of people I know like using them on channels that have as many emotes as possible, so, you know, the 60 emote channels. Um, hmm... I'm trying to think if I can get more value here. I don't think so. That can send a spell card. I guess I could get a link three going and then I just went off of that, right? But actually, do I? Wait, no I don't. Because I have to discard this anyways. What am I talking about? Wait, this is wrong. This is actually incorrect. Oh my god. Mm. Like, I don't lose or anything, I just... kind of feel like I wasted a card. Oh well. 
Yeah, I don't think this is worth it. I might as well just have summoned another Basilius alongside the Basilius and then went for Gorgon. <laughs> yeah, all this guitaring happening here. I think that was the last song. Yeah, it was. Okay. We're, we're, we're done with the album. Oh, yeah, I wanted to screenshot the decklist while I'm... I guess we're trying to like 5k-ish before we switch, right? There you go. This is what I'm playing right now. I feel like this is probably not it. I think... I feel like Evenly probably is a better choice than IDP, but IDP is not horrible, I find. Probably decent against... A bunch of decks. I also wanted to play multiple MSTs because of the uh, labyrinth potential. Mm, what else do we got? Oh yeah, we got the... Uh... Oh yeah! The techno mix of this song, let's go. Come on, all right. Lap your hands, keep the rhythm. Oh, yes. <laughs> Bro, I can't find my my album thing. Where the frick did it go? There we go. Oh, I uploaded the same image again. No. God damn it, I didn't screenshot, I guess. Hello. Mm Just playing loner deck looks good. Orcus, yeah, Orcus loner looks playable. What happened to Joel Jam? What do you mean? It's right there. Do you not see it anymore? Wait, did Joel Jam get removed or something? No, it's there. It's on stream as well. Well, I mean, our whole chat box fix started because of Joel Jam. Joel Jam wasn't working on stream, and then at times be better Twitch TV emotes aren't working, which is why I changed my chat box to this thing. And then Joel Jam still wasn't working, and then it turned out that emote got removed or disabled on 7TV, so it only showed up on my side. So we had to replace it, and this was the best Joel Jam there is, so... Uh...
Wait, this is actually a really rough situation because he has the non-targeting pop. Or the targeting pop, but he also has the non-targeting banish on effect activation. Shit, wait, that's so bad for me. That is actually really bad. I have to burn the Imperm on this. Let's go! I'm kind of terrified, but I think I have to pop it. Oh no, wait. Oh, maybe it's fine. Surely it's fine, right? Wait, it's an 8. It's just bird, right? <laughs> oh my god, wait. This guy misses the timing. How is this card so bad? I need Awakening so that I can go into Link 3 so I can pop this and then attack over this guy because he's the biggest problem right now. Does this guy target for the Yorink effect? Because I'm kind of terrified my opponent might summon a second one. Yeah, it does target a cam. Summon monsters left and right. Okay. Uh, no, I should be able to get rid of this guy. Oh, but I 
that guy's still a problem. Before I wait, oh my god, I have to like insta bounce him. Uh. Monka, yikes, because otherwise he can respond with this shit. Are you kidding me? Wait, that's so bad. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. Well, I guess alternatively I could have insta popped him. Maybe that was better. Yeah, I feel like it would have been better, but. Oh well. I should be fine though. Oh yeah, it's it's such a great event. <laughs> okay, but like I thought that realistically, right? If when I'm playing dark, I'm only playing against darks that I'm gonna have super fast matchmaking as light. Which I mean to be fair has been kinda true. But also like bruh. This ain't what they promised me at all. I mean, he's indestructible in battle, so... <laughs> uh, I have a bad feeling he's gonna normal summon and pop off. I think I should've just let it through and then popped it next turn. Uh... Oh, come on. Well, I guess it was unwinnable then, yeah. Man, that's just lame. I hate also that this guy's rewarded for playing a bad deck. Well, but again, I guess like it's not bad because he's supposedly trying to play against lights and they're more likely to have effects. Right. They have hand traps. Man, but that's so messed up. I feel like triple tech though just isn't good in general in this event, but hey, apparently it's great. It's not good, it's great. Anyone play Dogmatica Knights? Yep, I've played against a bunch of Dogmatica. I'll probably play some Dogmatica as well today. Is Branded Tier or Danger Tier a thing in the festival? Um, yes. Danger Tier, if you're looking for a more tier focused deck, I'd say. 112 in a row so far as light and got game with like 5 seconds every time before the server broke. But matchmaking seems rough for dark. There's not as not as many good light decks, especially cheaper ones, like the Zexo Sister, Drytron, Runic, Dice, what do you... Dude, nobody's playing those hand traps though, like, even in those matchups, it's kind of iffy, I feel like. And some boring blue eyes. Blue eyes OTK is probably not a bad choice as well. I kind of should have played it. I regret not playing the... not trying out the... Blue Eyes Cheese deck a little bit more. Because I think it's probably one of the better budget options for people. I mean, DD Crow... There's DD Crow and then there's like... Like, you're gonna play DD Crow with a high chance of playing against Exo Sisters. Nice, okay. Uh, you have like Skullmeister. Which also... Is completely useless in a lot of matches. <laughs> Bro, are you kidding me? Dude, I swear to God, this is Konami. Konami freaking shit up right now. But also, it's Konami showcasing how shit the card actually is. I mean, admittedly, he he targeted the wrong card. He targeted the wrong card. 
I also would have still had setup, it's just I would have had worse setup. Look, I am not going to make love with you. <gasps> Thank you for the Prime Gaming! Uh, Brady, uh, hope you enjoy the emotes. Welcome, welcome. So... <laughs> Get them. Not like this. Lion's addicted now, no! You know what? I don't mind the bingo addicts as long as they aren't, like, druggies asking for goddamn unjustified bingo activations. It's like, oh man, you totally had ten chain link 10 happen, bro. That totally happened. Those goddamn bingo druggies. Oh, that sucks. Story time? What do you want a story about? Like, what am I gonna... But I didn't do shit today. <laughs> I did mostly my, like, planned house tasks. And that's it. Any jokes? I'm not a very funny guy, okay? Your expectations are too high. What am I... Frank Sinatra? That's a joke about me thinking that Frank Sinatra is a comedian. It's not even a real joke. Bro, what the... Sprite! I love how I tried playing around... I tried playing around second removal card and instead got sacked by... by this, nice. Any stories? No. My god, that's so cringe, dude. Alright, I need to talk to Gorgon. I need Gorgon. Gorgon these nuts. I guess technically any evil eye card works as well. <laughs> I think Kaliyuga was primed to be one of the better dark decks. But then realistically thinking about it, it was like, okay, well, light darks are prone to have more... more, um... hand traps. But because of how the matchmaking is working, where you have so many dark versus dark duels, Kaliyuga is actually significantly better than it would have been already. Because you just don't have the answers, like, okay, you either draw Imperm or you're screwed, probably. God freaking damn it, I didn't need the imperm. Damn, this is so unlucky. I guess there is a chance that I survive though. They can kaiju? Light has more kaijus though. But also, I don't think that's a very relevant factor. You know, like, they're still negated for the entirety of a turn, and you're probably gonna have a massive board. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's also understandable, to be fair. In the events, it's pretty common to be like, okay, well, my opponent's comboing off, I don't have a great hand, I'm moving on. Which is perfectly reasonable. There's no reason for you to... No need for you to sit there, right? I need any evil eye card. Because if I can revive Basilius... I can dump uh, Gorgoneo, discard an Evil Eye card. Oh boy, discard an Evil Eye card. And then I'm chilling. Uh, I would have been scared, more scared, scareder. <laughs> would have been scarier if we summoned Denier first, because that would have been extra. 
Cure removal. Um. I'm trying to think of this matter. I, I guess I allow him to. Didn't matter too. Scared ear? Yeah, exactly. Kind of do have to imprim here and then he could dodge with the pop. But then it wouldn't make a lot of sense now, would it? Then again, I think it might have been in my best interest to just cope that he doesn't have jet in hand, negate the blue, and take less damage, because I am not really in a position where he can afford to take too much damage, am I? But then, then again... I'm gonna are still gonna be too high, yeah. Well, light people are also chilling with each other. I played like five light mirrors in a match. Or in a match? <laughs> In a row, maybe six. I was playing Exos and I non stop played against lights as well. I got Nibiru with his Exos! It's not supposed to happen. I mean, if I played five, that's like what best of seven? This is a nice, uh, relaxing clip. This actually doesn't work, by the way. The stuff like sucks, but it's okay. I'll get what I need. <laughs> I'll get what I need. Hates me, huh? Seven TV broke again. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. See, it works. It's better Twitch TV, it's not 7 TV. Uh, yeah, you're talking about uh on stream chat. Oh wait, you always said lethal. Man. This was commonly used in Sprite. That's really not that word. In Brandon V played, it kind of can, but I think there's a lot of better options. But it can. This is not an evil hero deck. He has like. This is a level 2. 3 level 2 summon. I mean, now it's even closer to what it was kind of inspired by, like the carnival events in Duel Links, where you had to pick from two different monster types. 
And then... Your team... You were put in a team... With four other people... And then you dueled against random other people... And in the meantime, it's very convoluted for... It's simple, but also convoluted. If you win, and if you lose, as long as you don't scoop, you get points. And then if you reach 40,000 points before the opposing team, arbitrary team, reaches it. Uh, oh wow, this is really bad. <laughs> wow, that's crazy how bad this is. Um, hmm. Okay. Well, I guess we're going here. Then then you get more rewards, I guess. And at the end of it, depending on which side wins, some people would get more stuff smile. And then for one of them, it was like, okay, depending on which side wins, we're gonna make cosmetics for that side. Should I have discarded? Maybe I shouldn't have discarded it. Mm -mm, Africa. Wait, I have no more targets. Okay, I really should have sent the... Uh, <laughs> the dead card. Oh well. Because then I could have also freely drawn. Oh well. Am I on a big win streak? Uh, I was on a big win streak. I'm no longer on a big win streak. I've been losing now. I was on like five, six game win streak before though. <laughs> Oh boy, another exciting day of <laughs> dark versus dark foggers. Oh god. Oh my god, dude. Oh come on, bro! <laughs> I hate it! This should not happen! It shouldn't be a thing! <laughs> Bro, I hate it here, dude. Paulo Gark, more like Paulo Narc. Because... He's a cop. And cops... Or disliked. Oh my god, dude. It's not about Super Poly B and 3. This shouldn't be a thing in the event. You should be playing against light decks, which means Super Poly shouldn't be relevant. <laughs> it shouldn't be a thing. Oh my god, dude. No, Tier Lab aren't the only decks that are good. There are better decks to be honest as well, but people play a bunch of different things. Lab actually is significantly worse as well because of this change. Because, um, in theory, the Uwu virus that destroys all small monsters was good against most relevant light decks. But now that you're playing in the dark, de dark decks, there's like a higher chance that you match up against someone where you don't destroy anything from it. Yeah, I don't remember which one's called, but it looks kind of Uwu. You know the one. Da 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 
Alright, you know what? We're listening to more Toto. How would you rate the loner decks in this in terms of power technical? I've actually not tried the loner decks yet, but I mean they definitely have hold the line maxed out for all of them. You gotta hold the line. Oh, why am I slouching so much lately? It's really bad. Uh Well, uh, very cool, very cool light versus dark event duel we have here. Very nice. God damn it. Bean Fairy was better? No, I don't think so. I think on average, like, the fact that you non-stop saw the same deck was really, like, not even just the same archetype, but literally the same deck was not very good. I think that was really, really, really whack. But they're not, like, executing this event how they even intended to, which is really scuffed. It's pretty scuffed. Yeah, I I think for most people, Fiend Fairy was really, really unenjoyable. <laughs> well, I mean, the, tell us how you really feel, goddamn. Wasn't enjoyable, but I wasn't. I want to die right now. Like, die, is it that bad for you? I don't know. I, I guess if you're playing against light decks, then I feel it. Yeah, the light decks that you can play against for the most part are really miserable to play against. That's true. Wow, that's a. That is what we call a hand. Shall I lend you a hand? Bruh. This hand though. No, no, no! Melfi Puppy! Wait, but you didn't even know whether he had a thingy. You didn't know that he had another kaiju, Cope Cope. I have to switch for dailies. <laughs> I have to switch around. I mean, there's decks that take forever on both sides. More so on, on uh, Dark, I would say. Can the black wings? <laughs> sure you can. You're definitely not playing a dark deck against black wings, right? I don't know, runic synchro with unicorn control. 
I'm sure there's something. Wait, was that your bell? Wait, 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 wait. Take me back. Wait, take me back. I hate that it takes so long to load into the replays, by the way. I feel like it should be instant, right? Like, there's no reason why it takes so long. Oh, great, a self-DK deck. That's great. That's great. Clap, 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 clap. Clap, clap, clap. Listen to the other version of the song. Like it's too recent, right? Yo, what is this? Flawless perfection. Oh, it's the, the field spell. Oh my god, Echo? I think this is like the second time ever I've seen this card activated. I think I've seen it activated once in Duel Links before. <laughs> and it wasn't good there. Oh my god. Okay, oh, uh, it's not a real deck, man. What a bummer. Why does he even have that then and use that? Man. Do 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 do. Bum 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 bum. We need to change this list around, I think. Probably need more... Less of this. And more of... Probably this isn't worth it either, I feel. And more of like ritual spells or some shit. Light. I wish to see the light. Bro, just let me in. Stop. Should I be trying the loners? I feel like. I feel like I should. <laughs> Side frames, maybe, maybe. Oh yeah, I did have an account where I don't think I had a deck besides Black Wings, which is probably a pretty competent deck actually. Well, I mean, I don't mind losing. It's more so. It's usually nice to be able to competently answer whether they're good. So far, if I were, okay. So far, if I were asked, were asked which loner is worth playing, I would probably say most likely only the. The one that had Orcus, if you know how to play Orcus. And that's it. What is when he, that's what I'm asking. I want to know as well. Like, surely there's something, right? Well, it's, it shouldn't be the team. Like, not the players, but the side for everyone, right? <clears throat> like, you had the Master Gig versus Jinzo or whatever. <laughs> You got Jinzo cosmetics first. Uh oh. Okay, but like this should not be happening, dude. God damn it. God freaking that. This should be happening. Exactly, this should be happening. If Dark Winds we get Rongo Cosmetics, if Light Winds we get Inspector Gordon. Okay, I mean... 
Say what you want, but I feel like the border cosmetics would kinda go hard, no? 2-0, let's go. Well, this could be either side, but I would be more partial towards light side playing this floodgate. Wait, why did I enter battle phase? I meant to... <laughs> Guys, I don't need damage. I'm that confident. I'm that confident. I don't need damage. It's fine. I am the damage. I'm already damaged. Yeah, 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 I gotta play around those. I feel like I shouldn't have gone this route. I forgot that the attack value matters for what you can search. I actually forgot, by the way. <laughs> I may or may not have forgotten. It's fine. I have this guy on the board and a counter trap or two, so what's the worst that could happen? This guy's playing some garbage anyways. Garbage turbo. Why do I hit Rongo so much? Because the card is objectively made to be bad in the game, okay? But is this in response? Oh, it's on. Oh, no. Unlucky. It's a new chain. Oh boy. It's fine, don't worry about it. Oh no. Bro, why? I don't want to play against these mother truckers. Everybody hates you. Even you hate yourself. That's why you're playing this shit. Why can't you leave me alone? Oh my god. Wow, these topics are so good. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? <sighs> this guy is just wanting to stall. That's all he wants to do. What the frick is this? Oh, well, shit.
Wow, this is such a fun experience. Thank you, Konami. Like, it's, there's no reason to be overly annoyed by this. Because obviously you can leave the game, there's no, like, no repercussions for it. It's more so just the fact that... It's so inherently unfun that it makes you question, like, why are you even partaking in this? Playing against that deck is such a shit experience. Like, why did the developers feel the need to make that, and then why did I feel the inclination to even, you know, participate in anything related to it? It's like, bruh, why? Why would you do that? You're annoyed? Uh, unlucky, dude. Yeah, Fun to play. Not gonna lie, I look a bit like Albazoa. Right now. <laughs> That's me IRL right now. Oh ah, uh. oh ah, uh. aba oh ah, uh. aba oh ah. Uh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Wow, perfect tactic. Why does freaking Theo suck so much? Bruh. I mean, I'm probably dead. She doesn't even need to summon a lot. Maybe, maybe if I get lucky. He's gonna have the trap too, isn't he? Uh oh, people French. <laughs> uh oh. Alright, I'll take the risk, frick it. Ay, ay, ay. And there's a chance, right? It's possible. What is that? Since when do we have that emote? Who even enabled that? I don't remember that emote. <laughs> Haha! <laughs> you guys look down on Theo, but here he is with his iron punch. His iron punch. <laughs> I mean, it's still really bad, and I'm still gonna lose, but 
It's still funny. Bow, bow. Behold his power, his punch of iron. I was gonna use the effect of uh, Magnifica to not lose her. And then I'm gonna even leave his background that I'm gonna lose because he doesn't need more than one summon to have OTK on board. <laughs> Nobody expects Theo and his iron punch. He has like Valor Ogre in hand. Wow. Wow, iPhone. Wow. Wow, iPhone. I mean, one of them has to be the, um, the Banish Trap card, because he was thinking what to do about my attack. So he definitely had two options of removal or protection. Sigmatica cheap to make? Uh... I mean, it kind of depends on what you have. If you don't have Diviner and Entus, then no. If you have them, then you can get away with a single Obazoa, so... Be okay. <clears throat> but, like, inherently, no, it's not. I think I'm gonna... Ooh, I might try to wait for him to climb all the way into Magnifica so that he wastes as much from his extra deck as possible. I mean, to be honest, I think probably better to play one, but, you know. You can't keep getting away with it! Okay, that was pretty good. That was a pretty good impersonation. <laughs> <clears throat> That's seven lab. Oh, God. They set the field spell? That's crazy. Actually, no. I think I let him climb to uh, Michaelis and then I... Yeah. If he has it. If he has her, he does not have her. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go. We're going. We're going. We're going. Oh yeah. I mean, he could tag her out still, I guess, to keep her, but... <laughs> All I did this game was I activated two evenlies, one duster. No, I didn't even activate the duster. I activated two evenlies, a Theo summon, and Nibiru. And that's all it takes, baby. You ever have trouble with, with Exo Sisters? You called Big Bro Theo. That's all you gotta do. Big Bro Theo will take care of it. He just can't resist Big Bro Theo. That's why we play Theo. It wasn't gonna be game though. He couldn't activate uh, another Martha. 
He already used one, I think, but also... Oh no, I guess he used the trap, yeah, but... Um... It didn't matter because he was gonna have a token. It's a Christmas miracle! Bro. Hacking called by. Goddamn, called by the grave. <laughs> you think I care being called by the grave? I'd rather be texted by the grave. Thank you very much. Sure is. I'm a bit of an even Steven, if you know what I mean. It is my personality trait, after all. Wait, why would you... I mean, I guess if he has the virus in hand, which would be pretty bullshit, but... If you don't have the virus in hand, why would you summon that right now if you're expecting me to... ...to evenly... Oh, maybe to pop this? Yeah, but it can't be destroyed, right? Oh no, it's only opponent's card. So I guess he could pop it if he wanted to. Hand drip. It would be very funny if he hand dripped evenly though. What? Oh, you want to keep it in the grave, I see. Yes. Okay, but like, why are we activating this now? Oh, because he's gonna freak me over. Oh my god, I freak it. Man, it's so good that this card is limited to one. It really changes everything. Oh, wait, ghastly glitch? Wait, where's the virus? Where's the virus? Maybe he does have honor after all. Maybe he does have honor. In before, this guy's gonna go a step further beyond. Activate glass like, get the Ku Clock, activate ghastly glitch, and then send Curse of Anubis. <laughs> send Curse of Anubis, no, Chaos Hunter. Send Chaos Hunter from the deck to the graveyard and summon her off of the field spell. Let's go. If he does that, that would be pretty poggers, actually. Did he get a second best card done? Like it's gonna be good. You carry me, burn me, figure me out. Got nothing else, nothing to write home about. Hey, what the heck is the delay? Tiada. Okay, that one. No, no, he already summoned Lady, it's uh, the Shandiga. Mm. 
This matchup kind of sucks though. <laughs> because uh, they have backwards to remove my shit. I guess it's only one lady, so... Probably needs... Oh wait, Big Welcome's in the grave. Uh, maybe not that bad, depends on the top of it. Um, well, that's <laughs> that's it, I guess. Good word, crazy box. True, true. <laughs> the days of your crazy box dominating every meta is over, lovely labyrinth of the Silver Castle. Your crazy box has been sealed. Oh, that could be a bit of a problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. He does have the bounce, which will recycle the pounce. That sucks. I've memorized, analyzed, but has yet to be. What does Crazy Box even do? It does everything. Behold, the mighty crazy box. You roll a six-sided die. You either hop your life points, draw a card, your opponent draws, discards a card, negate an effect of one face of card in the field until the turn, destroy one card in the field, or destroy this card. What a crazy box. A glimpse of idealizing. So tell me why. Sucks, but well, I guess he doesn't have any removal yet, right? If he doesn't run double field spell, then he doesn't have pops guaranteed at the moment. Hey, yo, pops! <laughs> yeah, it's really, it's really scuffed. Like you can't check what, what the limits for your opponent are, because everything is banned if you're playing against the correct freaking. Oh wait, what? Okay, so the traps, I guess you can check because they are... Okay, well, whatever. Oh my god. Bro, he plays the recycle. I mean, it makes sense, right? That's actually smart, yeah. Well, I didn't draw into anything playable, so I just gotta go, I guess. God damn. I forgot that that card exists, but it's actually good in the event. Are you kidding me? Have you tried Lab Exodia? I can't say that I have. I mean, he doesn't have to, but it definitely helps. Yeah. Oh boy, here we are again, and I don't run kaiju, so I just lose, I guess. Oh, or not. I mean, I can summon... 
I can get the ritual spell and then get this one. And then summon this guy. But if instead... And go for a girl. Let's do different names. That's 3k. It's still not lethal, right? Also, is this the right ritual spell? It's not, right? Uh, oh no, it is the right one, yeah. Uh, I mean, this one searches a small one only, though. I think it has to be like this, right? I guess I can send a little bit more so oh, I might get hand trapped actually because right. I mean this is so fair or not fair but so poggers. Like, it's just exactly what I signed up for, right? God damn it. God damn it, dude. Wait, I'm giving him search a shit! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Both sides of Emperor. Bro, he gets two! Not fair! What the frick? Stop typing. Hello. <laughs> and the fact that the spell recycles is all well, so stupid. Good. Engage the gauge. You banish a light in the dark. I'll probably boost it to at least 28. He might be playing on us as well, to be fair. Would be weird, but he could.
I have assembled all five pieces of Exodia. It's over, Kaiba. I zoomed the band because we don't like floodgates. Smile. Anyways, activate dimensional fissure. Activate the fissure. <laughs> hey, you can't do that. <laughs> you don't say no. <laughs> well, guess who's screwed? <laughs> of course, dude. Mother truck. It was better to start this one actually, but to let la 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 Oh, I'm negated. God damn it. What a fun experience, dude. I'm so glad that I have the ability to freaking do anything. In terms of choosing what decks I play against. I'm really glad that I can play light so I don't have to play against all these stupid light decks. I'm really happy. I'm glad. Mm -hmm. Wicked, I'll still go second. Nope, I was facing only dark when I was on Evil Eyes, so don't worry. And I was only facing light, well, 95% light decks when I was on Exo Sister, so, you know. Working as intended, there are no problems.
Cool. What do you mean? As light, you don't face off against dark decks. You play against light decks as light. Because they fricked up the setup. It's not game though, it's 35, it's 5 under, right? Okay, double rich. Kind of can, I guess? If I search for the 4 and then for the other one... Will I have enough to tribute though? I won't. I assume you can only activate this once per turn, right? No. Trying to decide between this, this, and this. I don't think I need the negate. The removal probably won't do much. Not frick it, sure. Other one allows me to banish from Grave Ruler, right? Okay, I guess that works. Haha! <laughs> Behold, my mighty Theo, sacrificing himself. For our godly leader. Our saintly leader, even. Ryoma, Ryoma these nuts. No, it can't be. Not Ryoma these nuts. Oh my god. I feel like... I struggle with how to address... How to address you, San... Sounds too short. Cellier is too fancy for me. <laughs> Who's Ryoma? Who is this Ryoma? Which Romeo? Romeo? Are, oh my god, can't speak! You know what? Frick it. I didn't ask anything. <laughs> god damn it. Sally? Oh wait, that makes sense actually. Yeah, but that's not how it's written, so I'm not gonna be able to remember. <laughs> God damn it, that makes too much sense. Mm. 
Sani Santi. I assume last one is Sally A, but I'm going to assume that it's Sally E. Sally E. EA Sports. Um, what do I have? What do I have? <sighs> this one's gonna be tough. It's gonna be really tough. Oh. The game die when the event start last night. No games in rank event. Nice. Well, I mean, a lot of things died, I think. In the morning today, matchmaking didn't want to work for a lot of people, so that's cool. Calamity, huh? Calamity, these nuts. I assume he has everything, right? I'm gonna summon this, but I can't use the recycling effect because it's going to proc Irene, and we don't want to do that now, do we? Yeah, this is such a bop. I love every incarnation of this. Mm -hmm. Today you discovered Mechaba has alt art. It, yeah, I guess it does. I guess it does, doesn't it? No. <laughs> I, that's only one, though. Actually, this is fine. Wait, this is fine. This is good. Yes. Yes. Woohoo. I just realized all he gets is Martha summon, so... Yeah, we're chillin', we're chillin', we're chillin', we're chillin'. No, this is actually fine. This is not... A this is fine emoji fine. This is actually fine. He can't do shit to me. Oh my god, and I can summon Theo! Come to me, Theo. With your iron... Punch. <laughs> yes! Dude, one... Guys, all I'm saying... All I'm saying... Is that we have a 100% win rate against Exosisters with Theo. That's... That's all I'm putting out there, okay? Theo hits the field against Exo Sisters. We, we've won every single one of those matches, which is all two. Why don't you want to play Black Wings? I never said that I don't want to play Black Wings. I don't have them on this account, I have them on a different account. I mean, I'll probably end up playing them at some point. Yeah, exactly. I actually, uh, oh my god, my opponent's playing the best deck. Uh-oh, but they're playing it wrong. Wait, you're playing it wrong. Wait, why are you going first with... with Abyss Actor? You're supposed to be going second, not first. <laughs> you're not allowed to play this deck in any other way that, except the way that I play it in. Oh, but, like, ironically, going first with this deck, in theory, in normal ranked, is okay if you ignore the fact that you need a three card combo for like the good setup. And you can't do the good setup in the event because you're locked to darks only, so... Why would you... why would you do this? Night rope dancing... Law of the normal streamer. What is the normal streamer? <laughs> <laughs> they don't know I actually know that it's law of the normal card. <laughs> I feel like it's probably one of the weaker good light decks, but it's still a decent light deck in the event. And this guy's gonna make heckin' Abyss Actor does not look good. Mm 
Oh my god. This is where I would say, oh my god, why would you even play this card? It's not even that good in this event. You don't even have a guarantee that you're going to play against light decks. If anything, I play against more of the, my attribute, which means for dark decks, it's not good to play triple tech. But I can't complain. He's playing the best deck. I can't complain about anything he does. He's perfect. 100% uh, perfect individual. They can't do anything wrong. They're playing Abyss Actors. Oh my god, why does he have so much back row? Okay, this guy is not perfect. This guy sucks. What are you doing? Why do you have so much back row, man? Oh, it's scripts. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> All right, it's a bit script, right? Yeah, that checks out. Hmm, I wonder if I should destroy those face down cards. Anyone want to try to see what's face down there? <laughs> Tempted to spontaneously build BES? Oh no, don't do it. I'm pretty sure they have like two URs, which is too too many for that deck. Very cool field spell, dude. <clears throat> B E S B E S T deck. Oh my god, you're right. How could I have been so blind? You're absolutely right. Uh, I believe I have won the game, sir. Oh, this hurts me more than it hurts him. You guys don't understand how hurt I am by this. I'm playing against my babies. This is so wrong. This is so wrong. <laughs> I don't have Ogdoa deck. I mean, I have like an account where I have one of the URs, I think, but probably bounces, right? I think most of the good ones are dark, right? I'm not sure though. He can send the pendulum monsters. <laughs> Uh, I don't think speed raids are my babies. I, I do enjoy speed raids, but they're too popular. <laughs> my kids are not allowed to be popular. I only appreciate my unpopular kids. Um... <laughs> But, uh, Gigibugs, I, I don't think I, I'm allowed to claim them as my children. I haven't played Gigibugs since the release of Master Duel, when I played them a bunch in the first event. With free-to-play builds all the time. Mm -hmm. Okay, but to be fair though, I've seen way too many Abyss Actor fans lately, I, I don't know. The hipster in me is like, nah, nah, I don't care anymore. There's too many people who like the deck now. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care anymore. When I'm done, got master one of it, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, I saw like, I looked at the event post on MDMA.com. Dude, there was someone who just unpromptedly typed I didn't read the usernames, maybe it was someone I should have recognized, but they just typed Abyss Actor Sweep or Abyss Actor Gang or something, and then someone replied to them, Hell yeah, or whatever. That's two people! That's already two people! That's way too many! Also, this hand sucks because of the defissure. Dude, can I stop getting floodgated, please? Mm, 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 
Yeah, exactly. It's just like, just like your IRL situation, right? You don't wanna, you know, you don't wanna be a fanboy for someone who already is that popular. That's why I only, that's why I only watch uh, movies that nobody watches. Yeah, ten dollar box office movies only. Uh, Valence is also too popular, to be honest. I feel like Valence is the same type of deck in the sense that they don't really have a reason to be, like, very popular or anything. But people like them, kind of. Like, there's people that like them. I feel like Valence are too quirky to not have a fan base. Wait, is this send? It is send, isn't it? Oh no, it's tribute. Should be fine, right? Wait, well, shit. I guess I wasn't sure what he was playing, but I guess I should have just activated this first so I could have gotten rid of my. Oh, well. <laughs> Dart is nice on Valence. I mean, that's true. But Dart is nice on a lot of archetypes. Um. <laughs> Listen, okay. You might be right. But I just have different criteria, okay? I just I just live in a different world. We live in different worlds, you and I. 0.03%. It has a percentile that shows up when the card is summoned. That's too much. <laughs> Appliancers lock your summons. I'm not sure. That's sub 0. Exactly. Speaking of which, where is my sub 0.01% play rate only event? Come on. Like, you, you need to have that. And then, okay, here's, here's another option. Try out dual decks with only over 50% card use, use rate construction. I don't know, I feel like that sentence doesn't make sense, but you, you know what I mean. Decks that only have cards that have 50% use rate or higher. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying I can't play them anymore because they have a new family, a better family now. They found a new home. I don't have to worry about them anymore. <laughs> True. Normal rank? No, 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 no. Listen, it's gonna be totally different. Yeah, the idea is that it would be normal rank and then they would have to go, Oh shit. People are onto us, we have to hit stuff. Wait, this isn't an Yeah, okay, we're fine. <laughs> Guys, in the last month I played against like three Abyss actors. Doesn't matter if it's been mostly in the events. Okay? I've still played against three Abyss actors. They're spreading, they're multiplying, they're thriving. And I won't stand for it. If I'm not the only one, <laughs> then no one can be the only one. That doesn't really make sense, but I mean, that's true, actually, but. <laughs> yeah. 
You got it, boss. Uh oh. Uh oh. Galaxy Trance. Actors are more popular than Spring and Sun. I think you might be. Mm, it's hard to say. I think Spring and S are too much of a deck to not be more popular, though, right? <laughs> Isn't that the case? Oh my god, wait, this is kind of not great. Oh, this is great, except it's not. Shit, man. What do? I guess I need to summon this so I can have a negate. But I have to, like, send an 8 for this. That's ah, fine. I have to have both of these goobers. Not like this. How does his attack gain work again? If your opponent activates a card or effect except during damage, you can send one monster from your extra deck to your graveyard, and if you do look at your opponent's extra, send one monster. This card gains attack equal to half to combine the attack of those monsters sent to the graveyard. Okay, he can be an attack. I think it's until end phase, but frick it. Oh wait, he can't be disturbed by card effects, okay. I mean, that's fine. I think he doesn't realize that he can't be destroyed by card effects, maybe. Which is making him, like, reluctant to activate card effects or something. But maybe he's actually smart. That's also possible. Mm, nope. Just like, no, you forced my hand! Now's the time! Now I negate you! You fool. You've played into my trap. Here comes my negate lady. You foolish fool. <gasps> Wait, what does this do? Attach itself? Or boost attack? Right? Or revive itself and boost attack? Boost attack. Okay, I don't freaking know. It does something. Oh, it summons galaxy and then boosts attack. No, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I can send a big one from his extra though. Um, he has a lot of big ones. Is this guy scary? No, this is the boost dragon. That's the yoink dragon. Africa, give me attack. Alright, this guy's negated. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, do they have to battle a monster? Uh, if, um, blah, blah, blah. Uh, when your dogmatic monster declares an attack. Nope, doesn't even have to battle. That's crazy. That's crazy! Uh oh. Ba -da -da -ba -da -ba -da -da Wait, I sh <sighs> I realized that I technically played into Gamma for no reason whatsoever. That was a little bit scary for a moment there. Ba -da 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 -da
You'd be scared for you, you for five events at least until now. Okay, they can do it still, I believe. You can cook something up. It's gonna work. Oh my god, like... It's... it's actually reversed. It's like, if you can't find a light opponent, they will give you... provide you a dark opponent. But if you're playing a light deck, you're most likely matched against the light opponent. It's not even random. I feel like they legitimately actually messed up the matchmaking, like reversed it. I think we just go next. Like, there's not really. Any... I can't play through this. If they don't brick, there's just no point in waiting. Gryshorn's probably like one of the better decks for. Like, getting scoop wins. Mm -hmm. Almost forgot to claim dailies, whoops. Mm -hmm. Our economy was in danger, but not, only, not any longer. To be fair, I guess I could play some kaiju, but... Uh. Imagine starting to play Master Duel, and all you see is Drytron. Well, I mean, that's how it was when the game came out. I mean, my first game in Ranked in January 2022, or was it February? Well, whenever the game came out. It was January, right? Uh, my first opponent, I'm pretty sure, was full combo Drytron going first. I was playing a scuffed Mega Lift list. And then... My second opponent, I think, was... <laughs> Zodiac Eldlich. Was what? Huh? I wasn't set five. I played Zodiac two with Eldritch, so it was set some, but also have Zodiac. So. Wait, what was there? Well, that, that sounds pretty good. I wish... <laughs> I wish, uh, I wish that were me. Do you have a picture? A picture's worth a thousand words. Picture. Picture. No, wait. Valor. Oh my god, no! Dude, all these... <laughs> The most ridiculous part is, I don't know if I can criticize this guy. Because theoretically, he could be doing this, or playing this, because he knows that most of the time you're playing against light decks. 
So it's, you know, bound to work in a lot of matchups. But maybe this guy just plays it because it's good and ranked, and now he's being rewarded for their matchmaking bullshit. Because he's not adjusting, so I'm like, god damn it. First replay, finally, actual light versus dark match? Oh no. I mean, maybe it's good. Maybe it is good. Well, that's annoying. Two choices. The thing is, if he knows what he's doing, he just double chains this, right? If I activate in this order, I guarantee that I get this iron. It's probably good enough. Or even they scary, but... Like, I could Gumba to potentially get the big reward. But, yeah, I don't know. Oh my god, he's going to dodge my negate effect. That's crazy. He's so good. I'm T4 because that card at least fun, but Bricky. <clears throat> yep, that seems about right. We're both on the wrong side of history, Peppa Hands. Please don't try to banish me, dude. Oh my god, he had ogre. Mm. <sighs> that sucks. That's annoying. I guess I should have gumbled on him being stupider. Yeah, I tried the Bujan deck, it was really bad. You most of the time just draw into like full Bujingi hands, which means you can't do shit. True, if only we had Theo. Are you kidding me, dude? Average hand, right? Oh my god. 
I mean, there is a chance, but it's a very small chance. So. And he has background anyways. Nice. So probably no chance. I need a matrix top deck here. That was the only option. Man, I mean, obviously it's hindsight 2020, right? I think I had to gamble on the opposite, like the less safe option then. Obviously sacked by G Ogre as well, but... I needed to gamble on... Gamble on him not being smart enough to go for the tag out into the banish. So that he banishes my... My other name. Yeah, this is unwinnable now, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, if he didn't specifically banish my other Dogmatica name... ...and tag out into another banish... Like, he had to do both of those if I went for... ...Glory Delegi before... ...before um, activating Matrix, I would have resolved Matrix. And then I can get out big man and that I'm unaffected by monster effects. Played heretics get stuck against either lab or light decks, yep. <laughs> Sounds about right. Man, Royal Ecclesia. This is not the Uwu virus, by the way. This is the third one. This is Corona. Uh oh. Cyclone Cosmic. Activate this. Oh my god, Cyclone number two. I got the Macabre. Wait, we can't even go in. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, that's awkward. Um. Uh oh. We're losing our troops. Top deck Eldritch. Get rid of the back row. Send this. Bring him back. Summon him. Bam! Now we're Eldritch. Oh, I deprived you of the animation. No. You have two of this artwork, though. Damn, Royal Fleur W2, that's crazy. Well, we get to set a field spell. A field spell. Grave uh, bounce effect don't work. Bam, bring her back. Oh my god, she's a zombie now. Now we can get punishment. It's time to get punishing. Uh-oh, cosmic again. <laughs> oh my god, dude. And face the golden conquistador of the golden land. Here's the summon, bounce it back, we go for attack, they go for retags, bada bing bada boom, summon this one back, we go for the pop, they go for the tag out, we don't get the send, they send from the hand, they get the trap card, bam, we keep attacking and we win. We win. I wish the Gmatica field was a bit better, but... I mean, I guess it's not, like, completely unplayable. Mm -hmm. 
only public reply. I mean, you don't know, maybe that's where the plot is headed. Maybe... Maybe he became Eldlich after being Albazor. He donned the golden armor to hide his new hideous nature after being corrupted by the dark powers. It makes sense. Well, free summon, go for the sand, bam, get the sand, nightmare, or cost. Uh oh, search for the Nagat. Here's the field. We link it off into Striker Dragon. Searching for a field. They don't fall for it because we already have the field spell on the board. Oh no, Galatea is here and she's top tier. We attack. But they don't do it in the damage ship for some reason. So we get to chain this and set a card. Wow, that's really kind of them. Uh, activate this Boot Sector la Lounge. Boot Sector Launch. I am drawn to another quick play. Here comes Chaos Ruler. Okay. <laughs> Got more stuff. Oh my god, how thread. Free summon from the deck. Discard symbol Skele. Activate symbol Skele. Rank it up into Ding Gearsu. Resend. <laughs> oh my god, IP Mascarena. Ba, ba, ba. They go for Max the Musketeer to search for more spells and traps, but we negate Max the Musketeer. Ba, ba. End of main phase, we link someone into Nightmare Unicorn. Ba, ba, da, ba, ba. Ba, ba, da, 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 da. Well, I assume we're just gonna get to climb to access code now, right? Oh, maybe we don't have to. Then Girsu Sen. Girsu Sen. I mean, I don't think anything would change if Gears 2 was a 3, I'm gonna be honest, so... I mean, sure. At this point, that's probably fine. Dum, 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 dum. Bunch of sets, here we go. Search for Tidy. Link it off into Striker Dragon. Thank for the follow, welcome, welcome. We get Torrential Tribute Ed. I get a free revive. We go for the summon from the deck. We go for the tidying and we pop the tidying. Reviving from the graveyard and summoning. Brute Enforcer. Discarding the trap and popping the dragon. Banish the trap and revive the woman. Because the dark was special, we summon the dragon. Or dark dragon, I guess. I think it's just dark, right? Triburst Dragon. We draw into this. We go for the Pisty Revive. They go for the Banish. Summon for Boral End. Negate and Revive from the Graveyard. Summon the Savage Dragon. It's kind of funny though that this is just standard. Relatively standard. Standard setup. Alright, got it. Cynthia. Oh, here comes the pops. This comes back as well. I go for the send. You can't be targeted. They crash. <laughs> I think it would have been better to wait because he does get a replay here. So if you waited uh, for him to commit the crash and realize that it doesn't work. Unless you also didn't remember that you're indestructible. I feel like it was better to uh, wait for it. Wait, can he not? Am I am I remembering something? Oh, Richard has a redirection. That's here. I guess so. Damn. The forbidden ability. 
The Forbidden Ability. Okay, I mean, for all the complaining that I've done about the event being objectively broken, not working as intended, I feel like this is okay still, right? I'm having a better time playing this than I did... Well, I don't know. I guess day one with lab event wasn't that bad either, but then day two and three and four were like, okay, I'm done. Chaos Scepter. I can't say that I am. I should check out what that is. Wow, another one. Here we go. <laughs> Woohoo. Uh. I'm trying to think if I use my gamma combo here. Post the picture. Okay, monkey. Wait, where did you post it? In chat? Oh, you did post it in chat. Oh, that's just my. That's Enkidu, though. But, uh... But that's just my Discord profile picture. When will Chamber get her dragon form? Yes. <laughs> Noise and what do you mean? a rough one because knowing my luck my opponent didn't banish a single Michaelis and a single Ellis and they still have it in hand ready but oh well um. I think objectively speaking it's probably incorrect to banish Ogre here especially if you play stuff like Cold by or and or other grave banish things because, um, you can't do that for Martha no. Oh my god, man. <laughs> no. Not the battle of the weenies. Weenie Hut Jr. battle. No. <laughs> god damn it, dude. Freaking hand trap. Those goddamn hand trap users, they have no honor. They have no honor. I feel like we've listened to this too much lately. I wanted the cover one, but I don't know where the frick it is. Is that? Oh, no. And I guess I let him, right? The problem is, I think I was a bit too obvious, right? Except it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. What do you think of mixing cash with punk? I don't think they complement each other specifically, but it's a very common combination that people play a lot for uh, obvious reasons. Having three level 7 bodies in a synchro deck that has a bunch of level 3 tuners is bound to be pretty useful. But in terms of, like, synergy, I don't think they really have that much. 
Um, unless you high roll, you kind of don't want to draw into them off of your pot of greed every turn. So you have more cards that are weak draws. And opening multiple Kashir is also usually not ideal, so, uh, like, it's definitely playable, but does that come out? Yeah, that's probably what's gonna happen. Well, he's probably gonna scoop before. But yeah, I mean, I played it, a lot of people play it in rank. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, Enkidu's not a girl, though, in re regards to the statement. Classic small world, uh, Nibiru into Irene into Nibiru. I mean, he's probably not sure what he has in the deck anymore, right? So... I think it's great that I also have nothing that I can do. Oh, he has Valor. I guess, right? No, like even lay here. Oh, I'm gonna scoop, dude. I lose so bad. Yeah, running existing in the first place is like, ugh, but then being played in the event is sad. Alright, let's crush his spirit here. What happened to their deck? They activated Desires twice. <laughs> they banished 20 of their cards. Deal. Show these girls what's up. G okay. All I'm saying is Theo hits the field and we win. It's just that shrimple. It's that easy. <clears throat> yeah, he banished... Banished extra. My opponent had four cards and no sisters in the deck, Kyrams. <laughs> like four cards left in the deck, so... In case you didn't catch that part. Have I had Garnets today? I don't think so. I guess we've had this, we probably had this, and probably this. You mean I'm not under anything? I'm on top of everything. I'm on top of my game here. Oh my god, I haven't listened to this in so long, but it's so good. I actually don't need to imperm her. I might ogre though. We got my time. No, no, we don't need to. We need to. Don't need to make our impromptu gamma or friend. I have Duster, so I don't mind him searching for cards. I'm just gonna destroy him anyways. I have faith that he doesn't have Solemn. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
I mean, surely you don't greet here, right? Wow, that's tough, I guess, but it makes sense. I'm probably getting railered, aren't I? Looks like he has double Valor. Another Valor in hand. But sure not be a re delay anymore. Mm -hmm. So he has another Valor in hand. Since we know that he had another Valor, it was better to keep a combination of these because he, under Imperium, with um, with Woman, he can still summon Xyz. Like, might even have a threat board. But if I have both of these, I'm more likely to be able to play through stuff. So that made much sense. Um, I think I might as well still go for her again. There is like a minuscule chance that he draws into another Valor, but neither of these actually guarantee for me to get um, a proper board, so I might as well just do it. Looks like that's ogre. Grr, ogre. Can I play a link? I could link to? I should. Yeah, it's pretty nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay, well. Sure. <laughs> okay, off of this, we make her, you know, assumptions. Oh, wow. Sure. I mean, it's not even just Lena. You could also just play Hipposhining again. 
I keep pushing in still decent, but Lena is not horrible because a lot of your targets are searchable off of uh, destruction. But my favorite other track is still a vocalite cover. Probably. Let's see if I still feel this way. Uh. I think this is probably my favorite. So. 800 defense, that's 300 too much. Oh, it's another ogre, damn. Actually, I feel like those are not very high on my preferences. <laughs> they're not bad, but I think out of other tracks, they're not as high for me. Like, I still enjoy them, obviously. <laughs> Well, he could have a third ogre. Um, damn, we got to the sleeves on two accounts already. That's kind of nice. <laughs> God damn it. Why was that good? I don't remember if I had these missions. They might have made a change to daily acquisition. Unless they for gore. I don't remember hopping to main screen after after dailies reset. True. Dude, I mean, we kind of have that as well. The Vocalate song that Adov wrote. That's kind of there. For usual, not like a huge fan of the syn synthesized voice, but at least it's tuned to not be too obnoxious. <laughs> Okay, the more I listen to this, uh, it's probably not my favorite anymore, but still really nice. <laughs> And when I said that, I remembered that the question that I was asked about my favorite show and the favorite character in that show, I didn't even say anything about the character. I just gave an excuse. Then I name dropped two series or two animes. And I didn't even talk about characters. But I feel like the answer is because I don't have a favorite. Actually, I'm gonna run P real quick while you watch replay. Be right back.
All right, I'm back. Are we watching this? Anyone want to watch this son of a lawn combo? You son of a lawn! Hey, Cody. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We're not watching it. Okay, we can go with that. Yeah, I mean they're gonna win. I'm curious more so like, oh, they are playing full on son of a lawn. Oh, there you go. Yep, and then they search for field. Yep. <laughs> Funny lamped. Oh no, you got... <laughs> you got scammed. You got scammed. Well, not scammed, but... Long ago, I used to have TTS on any bit amounts, and then... Someone was like, oh no, people could abuse it, being low value, and then someone decided to, like, immediately after that, abuse it, so they turned it up to, like, more. <laughs> I think. I don't remember what I put it to. I think it might be, like, 10 or 15, so... Or 50, I mean. So, don't, you know, don't scam yourself. Uh, I was gonna say you can use the free one, but we don't have the free one anymore, because I'm, uh... <laughs> I'm not using that thing anymore. Who am I? You don't want to know who I am. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I can use... You can use, uh... The gnomes instead to communicate. Oh wait, it works. What the heck? I guess it's a 10. <laughs> Thank you for the videos, nonetheless. <laughs> don't get scammed, the fool! You fool! You goddamn fool! I think I want more Imperms. Imperm seems really nice. Well, maybe... I don't know, it depends. I... I don't think I care about Waking the Dragon too much, do I? I mean, it's funny though. Alright, let's try it like this for now. Let's try it like this. Let me also change the field though. Why the DPE? Waking the dragon. <laughs> I don't have better targets. Oh, here we are. Oh yeah, I think I have... Yeah, okay, sure. I'll buy... I'll buy the thing. Which sleeves do we want? Do we want these sleeves or do we want these sleeves? Yeah, it's always these, right? <clears throat> Well, I mean, it doesn't die. You don't have to pop itself. You can pop a different card, so it's not really a one-time use. Alright, give me the... Give me this, I wanna see it. Why do they make it so bad looking, though? Like, I don't know, the, the, the freaking dirt looks really ugly in this picture. I don't know, maybe it's because it's super low res, but it doesn't look very good. All right. <clears throat> let's see if let's see if this can even compete with the uh, the Amogus. That's the that's the question. It's not it's not gonna beat the Amogus out. I can tell you that much immediately. But maybe it can compete with it. Make it like beach sand instead in the sand castle or something. I don't know. Like the sand in the desert field looks nice. That's all I'm saying. You know? That's all I'm saying. See, it doesn't really match the sand here, but it's not that far off, so maybe it's fine. <laughs> what are you doing? Funny actor. Thank you for the biddies. Where'd you get them biddies, son? What are you doing with them? I feel bad when people give bits because... Bits are so scammy in a way. <laughs> They're so scammy. I don't want you all scamming yourselves. I mean, then again, Twitch and... I mean, not Twitch. Twitch has never done anything wrong, but... You know, there's some iffy things. <laughs> Da, 
If it's Valor, that's kind of annoying. Oh my god, what are you doing? <laughs> no. Thank you for the super chat. Wait, why do you get like a beige olive green tone? Damn. I thought it was always just the same color. Wait, do they have the sc- Don't tell me they have the scaling color. Oh my god. No, it's a super chat. Don't worry about it. Uh, now I kind of regret the order in which I scaled, but... I mean, he definitely has Valor. I'm not gonna pop it. I'm gonna scale it up with the spell. Because this is a low scale. I'm gonna try to bait another negate if I can. Wait, what do you mean? It's not a gross color. Wait, you don't like that tone? I like that color. Wow, that's rude. I mean, to be fair, I like most tones of green, but... <laughs> What the? Why are you? Why are you gotta say that it's gross? Wow, can't believe this. Can't believe it. it's always the ones you trust. It's always the ones you trust. Is this the meme violin song? What do you mean meme violin? Huh? What is a meme violin song? Are you super producer? Well, I mean, what else am I gonna put in there? <laughs> what else am I gonna put in there? Yeah, I'm a- I'm a bit of an actor. But no, this is just a, uh, a banger by Toro Hakas, or not Toro, Taro, who, uh, I, so the song that I played two versions of earlier today on stream, the, uh, the Electro Remix one and the standard one, um, ooh, I don't have a kaiju this time around, that kind of sucks. I had heard that song long, long ago, and I recently, well, ever so often I think about that song. So recently I looked it up, because I remembered it uh, while talking to Mango about random music. And, uh... And, uh, then I was like, okay, I wonder what this guy has done besides this. And then I googled him and checked his wiki page, and apparently he, like, toured with not Whitney Houston, Celine Dion for like years or whatever until she took a break for her child or whatever. So this guy is like actually a big deal or something. Like internationally as well, I mean. I mean, if obviously it's possible to be a big deal domestically as well, but. That makes sense why he would summon an extra one. Actually, does it? You could have just ranked this one up and kept the card. It's going to be kind of tough, but we'll see. Wait, he has like a bunch of small children playing violins on the, st on the stage. Holy, that's a lot of small children. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Uh, I think I'm forced to... Go more neg here, right? Hmm. 
Okay, do this and I can summon her, scale that. Yeah, this is the safe choice. I don't wanna... I don't wanna, like, play into other stuff, so... I could assume that he doesn't know what to do, but it's better to not go under these assumptions, so... See which one? Oh, well, that's better for me because now I get to keep this poggers. Then I need it. I guess it's fine now. Okay, I feel like <clears throat> even when I was playing dark and light, I really don't feel that I saw a lot of uh, Labyrinth. Like, it's obviously a very playable deck, but I, I don't feel like it's that common of a deck right now. Of course, they could be wrong. They could be entirely wrong. But, um, it's okay. I reached the sleeves on two accounts so far. Could be worse. <laughs> it could definitely be a lot worse. Yeah. Well, I mean, they have the recycling quick play to reuse it, but yeah, that's true as well. We try to build Gandora Turbo. What then? <laughs> what do we do when we have Gandora Turbo? When does the fisting happen, by the way? Where's the fist? Also, I really don't like the... The pink or magenta and blue tones on this don't suit the graveyard at all. Like, I understand that they're default, but they don't look good. Freaking RGB graveyard. <laughs> Bury me with my razor black widow and my razor naga mouse. Ba, ba, ba. Orb Weaver, the Death Adder. <laughs> Nothing conspicuous here, officer. Don't worry. <laughs> Who's more pitiful? The burrier, the person that's buried, or the gaber without his death adder? Razor death adder. Available now. Do you think he'll pop it? I feel like it's too obvious. But to be honest, it would be kind of unfortunate if he does pop it here, because I have double Curtain Razor in hand. <laughs> he just couldn't resist it, now could he? Actually, is there anything that can summon that's immune? Uh, this one doesn't fiend block, right? I 
Well, that's a little bit unfortunate. Oh, he's a higher chain link because of us. Ooh. I mean, this is good. I guess if he pops this, it's fine too. Um, just get rid of this and I'm good, right? Um. <laughs> That's a good question, actually. I think because they just use their default, um, their default stuff. As per usual. Oh, he can't self search. Right, right, right. I mean, it doesn't matter. Why did I even go for this guy? Well, what even agree to go along with this guy? Oh, because then I can pop everything. Oh. Clever girl. Wait, does this lock me? I don't remember, actually. No, it doesn't. I was like, just in case this is a monster effect also lock. No, I think I like this a little bit better resource-wise. One. Two. Three. Oh no, he's gonna flood into a bunch of lo little garbage. No. Not Lil Garbage! They call him Lil Garbage. <laughs> I can't believe that Waking a Dragon worked out for us, though. That's pretty funny. Uh, was there a replay that I forgot, by the way? No. No. No, there wasn't. Also... I did see the comment of base list, but I feel like I didn't save my list, so... Then again, maybe you saw it before. Maybe you saw it before. There's little garbage with little garbage around. He takes care of all the garbage. I don't know, because this is generic copyright royalty free music. Today, I updated my MacBook after a long time, and I had to get used to it all afternoon. Crying emoji. I've been using this laptop for almost five years now, and when I'm editing my videos, the battery drains quickly and gets hot. I want to change it next year. I made today's video for those who listen to my songs over and over while studying and working at home. I hope everyone who listen to, listens to his music has a day full of peace and joy.
I'm gonna need both. Sub to my OnlyFans? Damn, but they didn't provide the link. How are you gonna sub to their OnlyFans? What the heck? Well, that's not very... You know, thoughtful of them. How are you supposed to do that? Rid of his back row, I need to get the get the nerd. Get the nerd on the board. Actually I might be Oh, I didn't think about that one, did I? It's okay, he'll negate. This is fine, right? I'm trying to think if um trips are a concern. There might be a bit. I'm sure that'll be fine, right? Oh my god, hecking imperm. Mm. I mean, that means he can't have a good back rope right now. It's physically impossible. If I wanted to. It is. Actually, it's not the best deck ever anymore because I played against someone playing Abyss Actors while I was using Dogmatica and they inted. So it's not the best deck anymore, unfortunately. It's only second best deck now. It is what it is. I don't know why he chose to go first, but he did choose to go first, so <laughs> it's kind of kind of his own fault, obviously. Yeah, at least I think he chose to go first. I'm pretty sure he did. I think I'm gonna play like a couple more in the event with this. And then I'm gonna gonna try to rank up at least once with Valence, but if it's gonna go bad, then I'm gonna get mad, but also just call it quits. <laughs> I think that's my... that's my, um... That's my plan for the rest of the stream. Did I like it today? Uh, what do you mean? The deck or what? 
I'm not sure. Event? Uh, I mean, it's okay. It does suck that they can't fix their matchmaking and that it's literally inversed where like, most of the time you're playing against the same attribute and then once in a blue moon you play against the opposite attribute, but... But, yeah. Whenever raid raptors are legal, legal, you always go for them. Oh yeah, you were asking for um for decks. There is a cheap stupid deck if you want the cheap stupid deck, and that's um uh blue eyes OTK cheese. Just a whole load of removal, left arm offering maybe, and then that stupid card that allows you to banish all your cards to special summon three blue eyes white dragons. <laughs> I don't think Ben KOTK is very good. Wait, why did he go for... Does he have another one? I guess maybe he does. Wait, is it a quick effect? Oh, that's why. Oh, that kind of sucks, actually, huh? This is pretty tough to be honest. It's okay for the event, yes, because you can just turbo a DP, so <laughs> it's functional enough. Actually, I think I messed up. I should have summoned the uh, extras first. Wait, does he know? Why is he... Why is he waiting? Okay, quit. That's kind of awkward. <laughs> oh, I'm lagging, I guess. Apparently, according to... <laughs> according to the game. Do, 
Thank Cardi and FDK for the event. Oh god. I mean, in Acetone stream I saw Cardians being played in the event room before the event started working again. I mean, it's, it seems functional, kind of, I guess. I think I should have gone for Milo Madonna here, actually. I'm not sure what your FTK route is, but I mean, cool, I guess. <laughs> that's actually, yeah, that seems pretty true. Yeah, that's pretty true. Yeah, that actually makes a lot of sense. Now that I think about it, I think, <laughs> I think you might have figured it out. There is a chance that I can just sack sack him, but I don't know. I seem a little bit hesitant. I did some, and I want to say, so it should be fine. I feel like, yeah, what's gonna happen is he's gonna be like, Oh my god, that guy has an animation! I best hit him before he hits me! And then... I'm gonna be annoyed perpetually. Um. Um. I mean, this is fine. I still have a plan. That guy over there has an animation. My god, he had the protection. No, that's so bad. That's actually really bad. I kind of forgot by now. Oh no, that's actually really bad. Yeah, I, I'm screwed. Well, that sucks. Yeah, I can't out this. He's just gonna sack me next turn because I have this uber on the field as well. I mean, I guess I can do this. I should have probably summoned an attack for that, but then again, this would also be low attack, so that's like... Then again, the healing doesn't do shit. I don't know why the frick I even bothered. Mm. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Man... Like, I guess I can pop that guy at least. really bad. Mm 
I mean, this could have been fine if he didn't randomly be like, Oh man, I gotta... <laughs> I gotta hit that guy because she has an animation. But even then, I couldn't do, like, the entirety of the thing that I wanted to do. It might have worked out if he wasn't toggled on and just popped two cards. And he can't respond and that's something, but yeah, it's kind of like, unfortunately. Whatever card I summon is going to be bounced back to my hand anyways. There's no point in summoning. Now I can't reduce it either. Nice. Guess I die! Because he's just gonna gain the difference in life points, so it's gonna gain like 7,000 attack anyways. I mean, to be fair, I'm saying that, but he had the correct choice anyways. Unlucky. If I drain to um, a Kaiju, I auto one as well, but... Oh well. I mean, didn't I beat Evil Eye when I was playing... Or didn't I beat Abyss Actors while playing Evil Eye action, now that I think about it? No, I played Evil Eye as a go for stuck as well. Yeah, never mind, that had to have been the America. Yeah, it was dogs. I summoned the 4k dude. Just have literally everything, nice. I mean, maybe he doesn't play more copies of Gorgoneo, right? Well, too late, he does because he's adding it to the hand right now. Uh, I mean, it depends on the meta. It's a decent card. I feel like most people would be fine without having... Every single a mission in one game. Is it true? Do you not need normal summons? Guardian's normal like once or twice, right? What do you mean problem notification? How do I keep opening my garnet, bro? Bruh. This sounds actually really bad the more I look at it. Holy crap. This is so bad. Oh my god. It's making me kind of angry. We play, we play. This is like a pen for one hand. One of the duels of all time. Alright. I'll be the judge of that. I don't think I finished the Mind Super yesterday. But we can do it today, I believe.
happen first. Am I gonna complete mind sweep? Or is my opponent going to finish their very restricted build combo? My hand was too good, to be honest. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. I was looking like I had a little bit too much I could do. God damn it! Brain, my brain, my brain is off. I'm panicking. I'm fumbling. I'm fumbling. Oh, well. Now it's very unlikely that I'm going to be able to do it. Bro, what is... What am I doing? Oh my god, Scent TV? He has that Scent TV. I thought I smelt something in here. Something smelling real nice. How are you doing? How did you... I feel like I didn't get to see you play the event too much. How did you... <laughs> How did you enjoy it? Did you like it? I assume it was still mostly scuffed though. During your stream. Since early on it was more broken. In the terms of like how playable it was even in the first... I don't think we've had too far. How is this guy still going? Damn. Impressive, really. I feel like probably... Oh my god, why do I keep throwing? Uh, a lot of the event... Probably... Your enjoyment of the event probably comes down to... What decks you're facing, right? Like, if I were constantly facing Runic, I would most likely not be playing that event, right? And there is some variety, so there is a chance that you can see, like... Other stuff as well. Almost beat two sweeps through both of them. Yeah, that's, um, interesting.
deck I've seen multiple times so far is somehow a lich then it go damn I don't think I've seen I mean I've seen people play play Eldritch in replays but I don't think I've seen a single Eldritch so far today actually that's interesting this guy hand destruction your lord and dusted you get tracked new Get wrecked nude. Maybe don't get wrecked nude on stream though, please. That sounds kinda monk at yours, now that I think about it. Maybe don't do that on stream though. Gate now. Yoink! Last week. It was last month, not last week. God damn. Traumatized you so bad, huh? I think my cat wants some food. I'm gonna queue up, make sure that I'm going second, and then run to give him some food. Also, I need to switch the music. Uh, I have no hand traps, and I must not hand trap. So, be right back. No, it's my nemesis again! No! I'm still waiting for someone to come into the chat and be like, God damn it, dude, I got sales banned wrong code! God damn it! I'm so done with this! Which would be a, you know, that would be a very understandable reaction, by the way. But nobody has done that yet. At least as far as I've noticed, so... You know, it is what it is. Did you? Oh my god. <laughs> Did you deck him out? Actually, I guess that's kind of true. Uh, this event sucks. I think it's okay though. <laughs> like that when you get Cybersonic Stereo. So every other game during Terra Meta is what you're saying. Oh god. Not gonna lie, I, I already forgot that that was a standard thing to expect. That was so bad, dude. Oh my god, she's going in.
Look at those guys. <laughs> They're so happy to be there. Gets to recycle a card. Oh no! This changes everything. Actually, I feel like I don't even need to do this, but I could, I'll do it anyways. There's not really a lot of value to recycling this to my hand in this specific situation because, um... Well... Yeah, I'm gonna just have two on the board. Like, what am I gonna do with them? Yep, a lot, all the viruses are legal. For if the matchmaking went back to being like working the intended way, then playing the virus that destroys small monsters is really, really good. Because, you know, there's a lot of small monster decks now. Mm hmm. Do, 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 do. Oh, I want to get the pen the small guys here, actually. Oh, well. That's why I'm not yoinking. Well, I guess... I guess I'm just attacking over it, then. Da, 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 da. Yeah, Super Poly being... Yeah. I love how some decks got nerfed by it, and then other decks got buffed by it. I mean, obviously it makes sense, right, that that would happen both ways, but so... Ugh. Yeah. Banishment opponent's board. No. Oh no, I've pushed Dark Hire, even though I played mostly light before today. No, Light Gang is losing. What? You're telling me you don't recognize... Um... It was the previous song. Yodlen is cool? Don't recognize that? <laughs> Wait, is he playing the FTK? Oh my god, bro. Bruh. Am I getting YouTubed? Don't let me get YouTubed. He has the combo. Oh, we're done. It's over. We're dead. How did he open it? He didn't even draw or anything. He just opened it. Bruh. I mean, to be fair, that's kind of similar to when, during the previous event, 
<laughs> when I had decided to make this deck, I queued up with it one time on stream, and immediately afterwards, the first game I just got it. And then for 15 games to show how unrealistic it is, I wouldn't be able to get it. Wait, he's playing Athena. Maybe he's playing something... This looks like it might be harder to pull off, though. <sighs> How did Athena burn again? What did she need? Is there like an infinite loop you can set up with her? Mm -hmm. Vampire Survivor second screen. Why not main screen? Hmm. Hollow Cure main screen. I've never played any of those games, by the way. Listen to this was the album that we listened to, right? Oh no, this is another album, and because of that one, we probably got that one. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, I'm sure it's fine. But why should I pay $3? When I have access... That's kind of loudish. When I have access to this. The ultimate game in terms of attack and defense. Let's reset. Oh my god, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. <laughs> Music to my ears, mom <laughs> That classic scenario where you're being yelled at and asked, would you like to eat more giga hashtag relatable? A, a childhood staple. Um... Okay. One here, one there, that's three, those are clear. One there. Uh, could it be both away? No, it has to be there, so this one's clear. Question, there's one in these. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. Am I winning? No, I'm probably getting FTK'd, but I'm just curious to see how he FTK's me, which is why I'm waiting. Oh my god. Bro, can I stop throwing, please? Oh my god, I can't stop throwing. Man.
Wait, what is he doing? Athena's? Oh, it's three Athen Athena's and they're gonna loop. How much is it per... It's, uh... It's 18 per summon, so it's three that's... What? Uh, oh. Only 54, right? <clears throat> I was at 60 something. I mean, he probably has a spell card to revive as well, right? Would be kind of weird not to. Oh, it's not once per turn. Oh, it's not once per turn, so I assume it's, it's just multiple sprites. Uh-huh. I mean, it's not masked because this is proactive burn, right? <laughs> oh my god, I kind of feel bad now that I did it. I should have allowed him to get it for the mission. No, I won't let him. I saw his secrets. I feel kind of bad, but... But then again, if you're an FDK, FDK degenerate, you can't really complain about anything. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody spamming floodgates. Mm -hmm. Oh, this hand's very unplayable. I feel like we've had this though. Oh boy. Well, there goes my, uh... Oh my god, that's so bad for me, actually. My hand is, like, all about not having this Cerulean on the board. Does that mean it's Dark World? There is a chance, though, I guess, but... <clears throat> okay. Oh no, a trolley is releasing 100 kilos of CO2 per year, which will kill 5 people over 30 years. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track. Hitting a brick wall and decommissioning the trolley. What will you do? I will not. I will not pull the lever, but I will maybe petition towards. Wait, trolleys are freaking electric, though. I mean, obvious electricity. Generated electricity still produces emissions, but like. Okay. Oh no, you're a reincarnated being who will eventually be reincarnated as every person in this classic trolley problem. What will you do? Like, why would it matter in general? Huh? Oh no, a trolley is heading towards nothing. But you kind of want to prank the trolley driver. What do I do? Dude, I don't want to go to jail. We've talked about this. I'm looking for ways to not... Not freaking... Take responsibility or be responsible for any of this. I know Charlie is headed towards a good citizen. You can pull the lever to divert it. Uh, 
to the other truck running over someone who litters and said, what do you do? Wait, just because he litters, first of all, how do I know he's littering? Maybe he's picking that stuff up, actually. But second of all, I don't know if they're good or bad. I'm not, like, murdering anyone. Oh no, due to a construction error, a trolley is stuck in an eternal loop. If you pull the lever, the trolley will explode. And if you don't, the trolley and its passengers will go in circles for eternity. What do you do? I mean, it's fine. They can, they can be evacuated. Why would I freaking kill them again? Like, huh? Oh no, this trolley is headed towards your worst enemy. You can pull the lever to divert the trolley to save them, or you can do nothing, and no one will ever know. What do you do? I mean, in these scenarios, right, when you're trying to save someone and there's no... Alternative? Obviously you do it, right? But like... Oh no, Charlie's headed towards a person. And it will lower their lifespan by 50 years. You can pull the lever to divert the Charlie and lower the lifespan of 5 people by 10 years each instead. Dude, that guy had too much life anyways. Five people. You can pull the lever diverted into the other track, sending the Charlie into a future to kill five people 100 years from now. Damn, that's a tough one, because they could have way better medical technology in the future and other preventive measures. But again... I mean, assuming that it's a driverless trolley, I feel like you need more information, right? It says kill? Yeah, but maybe they have a revival technology, you don't know. <laughs> maybe they have the power to revive people. Yeah, yeah, they might be able to. Alright, sure, we'll pull it. But I feel like that depends. If there's a driver in there, I can't do that because then I'm like... I'm sending the driver into a weird portal, right? Like, that's... That's not viable. <laughs> I'm... I become liable for sending that guy off. I can't do that. Uh... Sure. Uh, a trailer problem is playing out before you. Do you actually have a choice in this situation, or has everything been predetermined since the universe began? <laughs> I have a choice, and my choice is to not become convicted. <laughs> Congratulations, you have solved philosophy. Kill count, 81. Foggers. One hundred percent. I was waking the dragon works for me. I don't think it's worth it. But the one time that I set it and activated Duster against Labyrinth, they popped it and I got three free bodies off of it. Reborn, done. Take first step, done. Say first words, done. 
I don't think this one's very interesting. Oh, there's a baby map. Lights up whenever a baby is born, I guess. I mean, a lot of people have a good reason to think that it's boring. Uh... Wait, do any of these have protection? Does any of this have protection? <laughs> Wait. What the frick, dude? Can you please scoop? Yes, I don't have a great hand, but like, it probably would be enough. <laughs> yes, Angel is battle only. <laughs> Bro, this guy had me wait all this time only for that to happen. A great replay. <laughs> great replay. I mean, it sucks to play against. Playing it is cool. Like, no solitary deck is going to be fun to play against. Well, there are, there can be situations, but like, generally, generally speaking, it's very unlikely that that you're gonna have a good time against them because their goal is to play for a long time and then set up a lot of things to prevent you from playing as well. You don't play them for the opponent. Don't play them for the interactions, similar to playing Floodgate decks. Too. Or like go second cheese decks. I mean, their statement for nice board idiot wasn't meant to be very personal. It was mostly just making fun of the the futility of their actions. Oh, they got sacked by a singular lightning storm. And what, Ad Emancipator isn't long enough? Ad Emancipator can combo for 14 minutes as well in turn one. I think it depends on the hand and the build. But like, every combo deck is kind of not great to play against. You're finally home tomorrow, A. Hey. Nice. Okay, one more and then we'll play a bit of Valence and then... Oh wait. Oh, I thought I was higher. I thought I was at 5k. <laughs> yeah, it's understandable. Da -da, da -da -da. Isn't waking the dragon kind of counterintuitive in a deck that wants its back row pop? What do you mean? You mean in the sense that my opponent might not- Oh, I forgot I put these in! Oh my god, they're so good. You think my opponent wouldn't pop them or what? You have way too much faith in people's awareness of abyss <laughs> actors, but second of all, you can force pops anyways. I think a better argument would be, wouldn't Waking of Dragons be counterintuitive for a deck that's going second? To which I say, yes, but it's funny, so we're playing it.
he knows what's the thing with your D, surely the last thing he would do is want to do Duster. Well, again, people don't know what the fuck does, so... It's not really a concern, realistically. I have a bad feeling about this imperm thing. Oh well. <laughs> Unlucky. I'll just spend for three or two, I mean. Actually, can I pen these guys? Oh. I can pen one. No, not in perm. No. Oh, I'm locked, alright. Yeah. Unlucky. I'm locked because of this guy. What about woman? What does she say? Oh my god, why is it battle only? <sighs> it's kind of annoying. This is the highest damage I can go for, but uh, he might have, he might have, um, Ash, or not Ash, evenly, which would be really bad. What light deck would, this is, um, uh, Exosisters, right? Uh, oh, well. <laughs> I have to cope, but it's probably not going well for me. Looks like there is another Veiler, maybe? Maybe not, though. Oh, it went through time, that's crazy. Oh my god, bro, why? 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 Oh my god. No. Oh well. If you don't have bingo somehow, I don't know what to tell you. Get good, I guess. <laughs> oh, bro. I mean, Gamma is better lately, so it's not that crazy, even I feel like comparatively. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he just didn't trust like that because I saw I wanted to go second. I didn't open good enough, though. That's kind of unfortunate. But I guess playing through Imperm Valor Gamma is. Like, that's kind of a tall order. I need to open really good for that to be a thing. And I miss out on extras effect because of, um, reasons, uh, no. Um, I don't think I get OT kid here, actually. He has no back row. Uh... Actually... 
Yeah, but he summoned... He already summoned, uh... Alice, right? Yeah. If he still had Alice summon, maybe with all... Oh. That kind of sucks. Oh boy. Yep, now I die. Without called by with how he played it out, I don't think I would have died, but But with it comes great suffering. Um, unfortunate. Does he already have pucks? Max. Packs. Packs. Wait, oh, that was me. Oh my god. I was like, did I miss this 100k channel point redeem? And I was like, oh wait, I redeemed it. <laughs> I redeemed it as an example. Oh wait, there's a replay that I didn't do so. World armor, please tell me you're still here. I forgot, I'm sorry. I hate decks that ignore the rules of the game. I mean, I kinda get it, but I also feel like Exos don't do it in as annoying of a matter. So it's not as bad. I wouldn't say only, but the shifter shitter is definitely the main annoyance. I, I do agree with that. They even asked about missing your replay. No, I missed the question about missing. Bro, can I, like, not draw the same thing? Jesus. <gasps> no, I misplayed! Oh, no! I misplayed. How did I manage to misplay that? Bro. I fucked up. I fucked up. I had game, but I fucked up. Oh my god. Okay, I mean, who can blame me, right? Only God can judge me. <laughs> oh, that's so bad, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I... I don't think you understand. I've reached Master 1 with this deck. I've played a little bit more than a couple games of it. So the fact that I allowed this to happen is kind of insane. Wait, oh, wait, he says actually exactly at 800. Wait, it's fine. <gasps> never punished. Actually never punished. <laughs> oh my god, I'm such a lucker dog. Wait, actually, do I have combo? Oh wait, I might have not had combo because I already used curtain. Yeah, but I would normal summon curtain. Yeah, never mind, it was still combo. But there was a delay on summon. I'm kind of terrified. What if it's like torrential tribute? Da, 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 da. 
Does it matter if we do the event dailies now, or can we wait before the week is over to collect daily gems? Uh, there aren't dailies for the event, I think. Are there? There shouldn't be, unless they changed how their event works. Oh my god, if he has an imperm, that would be pretty yikers. You had the luck of the draw. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna wait for World Armor to come back, by the way. Wait. Huh? Wait, what is the delay? Or what do you got there? <laughs> what is that? Summon monsters left and right. Monka Giga. Is that Droll? He's playing Secret Wind types in his... in his deck? What the heck is that? <laughs> I gotta, I gotta justify this guy. I mean, to be fair, we got him early when we pulled for actor stuff, so it's not like I could have dodged him and saved him. It was Nib! Oh my god, thank god we played around it. Oh my god, I'm so lucky that I played around it. Bruh. Oh, that's so lucky. <laughs> I mean, I had no reason not to play around it, right? But like, oh my god. World armor! World armor, where are you? World armor! <laughs> I might have to refund them. <laughs> Since people usually do want to be around for their own replays. Man, it's so chill playing Ghost Second X and Samantha. If you, have, if you play actual kaijus. No clue. I mean, assumption is probably whichever side. Oh my god, is this the FTK again? Whichever side wins. Will be what type of cosmetic we get later or something, probably. Hey, don't tell me you have the combo. There's no shot that two people are consistently opening this. Bro, how? I played the shit so much. How did two people in a row just open the three card combo against me? 
What do you mean? Bro. That's not fair. How the frick? I think it's just sucks, by the way, because it's like a gigantic waste of time. I can understand that it's not happening to them every single time, right? It's more so the fact that it happened against me both times when I saw the deck is what is ridiculous. Also, I didn't draw my one of imperm either time. How could that happen? My one of imperm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay, dude. Go off. When the world is dark. Am I winning? I've been FTK twice, but other than that, yeah. If you don't count the double FTK, I'm doing fine. <laughs> Athena FTK. They opened three card combo and drew their entire deck. Boy. Yeah, Dark Horde's really awkward in the event, I feel like. It's, I, also, I feel like you can't play it as a go-first stack. Because... Like, all... The, not all of them, but majority... The majority of the good cards that your turn one board ends up with are generic cards. Like, you can't... You have nothing to really end on besides the fusion. Well, I'm, I feel like going second in general is just way better in the event, right? Wait, did I miss world armor or are they still not back? I think they're not back, eh? I might have to refund them. Be right. What? You don't want gold to be in the graveyard. When I use, do they have to be different names? No. What? Let's just hand this gift. You had a danger already, bro. I guess targeting protection? I guess that's better than nothing. <laughs> They're breaking, yeah, that's also true.
It's okay. We're fine. What is that IP? Yup. It's IP. Mm -hmm. Bro, that can't be your... That is entire board. <clears throat> cool. That's pretty cool. Oh boy. I mean, what's the deal? Yeah, I feel like you... You don't... You don't win this, dude. <laughs> I don't think you win this. Alright, let's get the sleeve and then see if we can sack with Valence real quick. Yeah, that is, um... I mean, he... he he did something there, I can tell you that much. Something was definitely done there. I don't know if it was gaming, but something was definitely achieved. Am I winning? Yes. Oh my god, you're back! Yeah, we'll do your replay after this. Macro scary. Actually, gig is scary, but... Oh. Well, that helps. I I really don't regret crafting the two extra lightning storms on this account, not gonna lie. <laughs> I feel like lightning storm is pretty good. Been coming in kind of clutch. Just went against one of those fair 50k players that surrendered when activated Trickstore Festival. Yeah, it checks out. I mean, that deck is unplayable if you get imperm either, so... Most situations, it's unplayable. Because I'm smelling an imperm, I'm gonna do this because I don't want the scuffed scale to be up. That's fine. This guy's a trooper. I might get nibbed, but, eh. If it happens, it happens. <coughs> okay. Um, thank you for the fun, but welcome, welcome. Mm. 
As I said, I might get nipped, but if it happens, it happens. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, replay time. Whenever this happens, I'm always like, oh wait, I knew what, know what he was playing, yeah, never mind. All right. Let's see that duel of all time then. Are you gonna find the tier list negative one was playing the other stream? Uh, the VOD channel is the easiest one, but I can actually... Okay, let me pause real quick. Uh, get your screenshot ready, I guess. <laughs> there you go. That's the list that he was playing yesterday. Obviously, a lot of the stuff can be adjusted, but... Yeah. Did you get it? I guess if anything, I can link it in chat as well for you. There you go. Eevee. Eevee probably isn't as good. Well, it depends. Like, if you're playing against Darks mostly as we seem to be playing, then Eevee is probably actually better. But normally, it might be better to play the other virus. Alright, they pop the third flames. Okay. Go for Fusion. Hmm. Main phase time, so we fuse. Ogre. Uh oh, we get Ogre. Don't matter though. Fuse, summon Rex. Proc to revive. Revive. Call by the grave. Uh oh, we revive her. Don't call my grave. I set the trap. They go for search. They jabated us. No! Albazoam. Send the card. Pop the Rex. Revive. Send. Burn. Summon this guy. Send the cards. Go for the pop. Pop the pop. Go for this. Search for the dude guy. Send the sender. Return to sender. Return to banish pile. Destroy everything. Revive the great wall. Well, maybe not that great, but, you know. Ah, counter trap to protect from battle damage. Now's the time to come back. And the counter trap. Go for the attack. Become immune. Revive from the graveyard by banishing a trap card. Woman. Set the trap card. They send the Rex. They make us send even more. We go for the fusion. Summon a Rex. They summon the Negator. We summon the Endless Creator. Lord of Heavenly Prison. We are negated. They destroy us, which allows us to float into Kentrogena. They destroy Kentrogena, which allows us to float into Small. Small lets us set a trap card. And then we float into nothing, because we don't have the target. The Great Wall of Dinos. <laughs> we revive the Rex. We pay to reduce, but they're unaffected. They send her last guy. We pop. 
We <laughs> float. Kent Regina hits the field. They summon back... Or they summon this guy, but not in the EMZ. We Torrential. If they summoned it in the EMZ, they could have revived Rexterm, right? <laughs> They summon Max. We go for the alert, reviving again by paying 6 life points. But we can't attack over the 3k defense. We pay more life points to be down to 4. <laughs> We're down to 2 life points. Imperm, we negate it. With one life point left on the field. Banishing a trap card and rubbing from the graveyard. Dude guy, Diplos. We go for ritual summon, we go for Imperm to prevent it. We can't allow that abomination to hit the field again. We summon Diplos. They bring back Albazoa, but they have no other cards and we activate Ferret Flames. They can only leave monsters with a combined attack of one on the field. But we can't kill them still. They top deck into come on, give me a matrix up, oh, never mind. Would have been kind of poggers to see a matrix top deck so they could play again as well. <laughs> Just for one last cope. <laughs> Oh boy. <clears throat> okay. We'll play... Maybe for a rank up, maybe not. I don't know, we'll see. Probably not for a long time. I really don't like that the Foolish Burial field actually is the load in, like, the animation that happens when you load in. As far as I can tell, oh my god, brother. I'm fucked. Of all the solitaire decks that I could have faced, it's the one that stacks your top deck. But yeah, I really don't like that, at least maybe I didn't notice it, but I don't think it shows the animation on that field part afterwards, which kind of blows. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think we're just coping. We're coping that he doesn't have access to woman. That's not GG yet. Can it more? Emotes? Which emotes? Oh, um, better to choose GV. BTTV emotes, the animated ones aren't showing up. Or, I guess most of them aren't showing up in uh, on chat. 
I don't know, sometimes it breaks. I don't think there's anything I can do about it, though. I mean, the 7 TV ones work. Um, I mean, this is fine for now. Unless the Aurora Dons. Oh god, is this an Aurora Don gamer? Oh, that could suck, I guess. Surely not, though, right? Okay, I guess the refreshing cache works. Yeah, I mean, it really depends, right? It depends on how he starts, but... It's not uncommon for it to not be enough through one ash, right? Like, it happens. I advance my troops forward. Valence, Mad Marcus, move forward. One piece. One, one piece. The one piece. Advance forward. One square. Bro, stop! Why? Why do they hate me? They hate me! Assuming that it's Imperm... They hate me because they ain't me. I'm trying to think if I want to use my normal summon for this. I mean, I don't think it's gonna matter. I can't do TK still, alright. Uh, this is so scuffed. What was his last search, by the way? He recycled the field as well. Oh, God. I guess if I can get two of these out. I don't have a water. Shit. Did this guy do a move? Like, I'm not adding another card anyway, so I don't think it matters. This is very unlucky. His delay is the... Um, the garbage. In the graveyard. Uh, Imperm too strong, Pepe hands. It sucks that I can't search for her and then just pend anyways because I don't have a high scale. 
<clears throat> Maybe wait. Shh. No, it doesn't bounce here. Never mind. It's like maybe it matters. Like no, no, it doesn't matter here because it wouldn't bounce. <laughs> if the abyss actor bounced as well, then maybe it would have mattered. He can scale on move. I guess this guy plus this maybe. Yeah, I guess. But yeah, this Giga sucks because, um... <laughs> I mean, if I had rolled a higher dice number, had another card, I think it might have been enough, but... Oh, he didn't revive. What? Why? Why didn't he revive? Bro, come on! It's not fair! Why? I rolled one twice! Man... That's so unfair, dude. I would have had the pop, I could get rid of the field spell. God damn it. It's not very hard to get rid of Avermax, I don't think. I mean, Apple is probably my best shot. Damn, this sucks. Unlucky. And so I'm playing Fabled. Can you fully play them? I feel like you're... Wait, are they light? I guess they're all light, right? Yeah. Okay, maybe you can. them Fog? Yeah, with this I can't do anything. Oh, maybe? Wait, why is he risking it like that? Oh my god, come through one time. It could happen. This is failable for him. I mean, sadly it's 50-50 and honestly it's like 70-30, but... Oh wait, I can negate it. Wait a minute. I don't even have to let him do it. Kick, wait! He fucked up! He thought he was invincible. He thought he was invincible, but he wasn't. Oh my god. Okay, this is like just barely gonna work out. Whew! Alright, we don't lose yet. This is- I'm not in a very good spot though, but... A lot of top decks could save my ass. He's gonna keep it. Shuffle this guy back, right? What? <gasps> okay, we're good. Huge! Massive! Huge badonkers!
Not really, actually, but... The classic word combination. Um... The question is, do I go for field play here? Or do I go for... Name... I think I actually care about field bookmark. I mean, I should win no matter what. His hand is two dead cards and his, his grave effect, right? Yeah, it should be fine. I don't think it really matters that much. Especially because I can get the search off of this as well now. <sighs> okay, that could have been really, really bad, but luckily it wasn't really bad. Feels good, man. It's only 1k, but <clears throat> I guess that's enough. That's enough! Uh, oh wait, I don't have a four. Oh no, I do have a four. Yeah, yeah, nice. Um, yeah, sure. Let's get a move man as well. Oh wait, I didn't even need the level, <laughs> so what am I doing? I'm gonna bounce this back with um with this guy's effect instead. Oh wait, that's the last one I have as well. Ooh. And awkward. Oh my god. Well, you know what? I feel like I earned that one. I mean, he didn't open great, but he had combo. If I didn't have Ash, so... And then he just kept using his... Re oh no, the replay. No, I'll do it after this. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, of course, whenever you click on it. I mean, I didn't even open. I don't know. I guess his imperm also stopped me, but my die rolls were like the biggest part. The fact that I rolled a one twice was really, really bad. Like, if my die rolls were a bit better, I might have had OTK turn two still, even through the imperm. Well, <laughs> this is going to take some time. I hope you're ready. Alright, sure, let's play some Sudoku in the meantime. Um, twos, twos, twos. Can't. Here. 
done for for here. Up here, middle there. Bottom here as well. I guess this one's more. Uh, top that. Five, six, five, wait, five. Five is on the side, that's a five, so it's a five here. to be on the side for this one. There's one here, and that's also done. Threes were done at the very beginning. Four, 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 five, five, five. Side here, there's a man here, up in the middle. Seven, seven. Uh, I'm certain at the moment there's. Or here, can't the other way, but where? <laughs> Elsewhere. Um, the el the other where? Um, two, we got three, we got four, we got five, seven is missing. Here, seven on this one, which means that's a seven here. I'm getting hand ripped, that's kind of unlucky, I really needed that card, but oh well. Bam, 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 that's a seven here, last seven here. The eight's out while we can. Here, top. Eight here, which means here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, six, seven. right, yep. This one, four. That one there, one here, one up there, down here, one in the middle here. Done, three for done, four are mostly done. Five here, here. Six, six, seven, so done, eight, done. They're all nines, right? Okay.
Ultra. Which one did he search? Did he search a good one? No, he searched for Drus for me. He can't do shit with Drus. Unless he already had the other guy. Oh, that would suck. That would be kind of not great. I mean, I guess there's a lot of scenarios that would be really bad here and unplayable, but... Oh well. Mission have activated field, but then again, if he has Ash, he... Oh. I don't know, maybe he does now, maybe he doesn't. Is this game of my life? Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> I've been betrayed by the dice before. I mean, I guess I have a scale at least, so that's true. But never say never. Come on. Oh no, not the blind Druid Swarm. I think, honestly, the biggest problem with the Druid Swarm here isn't the fact that he gets Drew Swarm on the board, like, that's whatever, obviously. The biggest problem is that... He's gonna draw a card now. That card is scary. Wait, how did I lock myself out of this? Is it the... I should have loved it before. What locked me out of the second lava? Damn, that sucks. I'm gonna go for an extra draw here. Yeah, well, <clears throat> I could have been on like three specials, but now it's gonna be mine. But then again, I guess he did it in response. That was mine. But actually, it is worse because I'm giving him more draws now. Because I need the removal off of her. Shit. It actually worked out so well for him. I wanted an extra pen summon target, and he just got a just got a freebie for this. Yikes! And now watch me get completely, absolutely sacked by two top deck cards. Didn't happen. Lucky. <sighs> what have I not procced? Thing is, like, he's drawing into bestial, so. Oh boy, that's not what I was hoping for, but I guess it's fine, I haven't used the effect yet. I have to 
let's go back, I guess. I love how he drew into Maxi off of Branded Regain, by the way. The the power of one draw to proc into like 10 more draws feels good, man. Oh wait, this effect might matter actually for a change. I'm trying to think if it's still lethal. It should be, right? Wait, how do I... Shit. I guess with the pop, right? Who draws though? That's kinda... Ooh. Shit is so scary. Oh, I guess I just attack over. How much is this? This is 30, 73, it's funny. Or 4.2, no, 4.75. It's 31. I'm thinking whether it's safer to go for the pop. With the pop, it's 3k plus potentially 16, 46. I guess it's safer, right? Assuming that he survives, I will have to go into this anyways, so... Also, I guess I can summon an extra guy out if I need to. I don't want to, but... Okay, we have a replay. I see a 5.5, we burn him. The level 10 that we summon, the one material, <clears throat> the one material fusion burns if we return a card. Well, on summon you can return a monster from spell trap zone back to the hand. And uh, if it's returned to the hand, they take damage equal to its attack and I gain half of the damage as attack on. So it's like really good for setting up OTKs. Oh my god. Is that Dom? Hello Dom, how's it going? Wait, didn't you have like your stream anniversary? Happy stream anniversary. Guys, if you like drumming, you like drum music, you like video game music, you should definitely check out Dom Palombi music. Oh my god. <laughs> GG's, yeah, thank you, thank you. It's sad that that deck has like two ways of being played real- well, there's three ways. You can play it as a casual scrub and meme around, and then you can't beat anything. If you don't play into generic cards. You can play it as go first, set up fossil Dyna plus secret village of the spellcasters, or you can go second and sack like I'm doing, <laughs> so, you know. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's pretty cool. It's not like a pendulum pendulum deck, I feel like, because a lot of your power plays are from... I don't know, the fact that you just spam out a lot of cards, but you don't need to pen to do that. God damn, I'm going in with the, the moves here. Is it tier zero? In my hands, it's like tier 50. But in your hands, it might be tier zero. Wait, what is what is this guy doing? <laughs> okay, fusion destiny, okay. Okay, okay. 
We're we're actually proccing. He's gonna be popping. We're doing this. Oh. Oh, we're gonna lock her dog. I, I can feel it. Oh my god, the IDPP! That's huge. I was gonna say, popping so early, but I mean, I guess it didn't matter too much. And we get to revive this. That's true, you move, you have so many move men. Well, actually, you have two move men, and then you can play, you can play Senet Switch in the deck as well, since you can search for it. I feel like playing one copy of the Field Searcher isn't horrible, it's just I kind of wanted more room for other stuff. But you can potentially do that. Um, and then you have a Searcher for Senet Switch. And you also have the spell in the graveyard that can be a move thing, so oh my god. This guy's getting wrecked. What's he gonna do? Recycle his uh, brand of fusion? What are you gonna fuse into, Bozo? Yeah, this archetype has a card that can search for his net switch. They printed it like two years ago or something. Damn, that... That uh, mill off the top for IDP was nuts. Valence Wars, the place of beginning. Allows you to search for a Valence field, and then if you destroy a pent card as well, you can search for Sinet Switch. <laughs> so it's kind of sad, they kind of they power crypt Sinet Switch. I feel like it's not really worth playing, unfortunately. You can get like a lot of extra value, and honestly, I, well, I guess for bridges I have to play the water level 8, but... He loses a lot of value as well from Sinet Switch not being around, since he could recycle it and whatnot. Wait, was that on me or was it- no, it was from him, right? I was kind of worried though because it was taking so long. Oh, is it actually? Oh, okay. It was taking so long. I was assuming that he's AFK and that um, he's gonna make me go first by accident from being AFK. I have, for the record, I have absolutely no plays going first. I can't do anything going first. I think I actually don't commit to the early max C here. Mostly because it's a good bridge target, potentially for small world if I draw into it. But also, I don't know what I'm playing in straight, so... Oh, oh see? We played around the... the starter. Hmm? Poggers? And the fur gamma. Please don't gamma me. Honestly, just call by me. Yes, I watched Oppenheimer. No, it's not Batman. Yes, the ninja structure news is real. I didn't get a leak. Rush Duels looks pretty good, but I'm not switching to it. New Kashira is freaking awesome. No, I'm not going back to dueling streams. Editors are expensive. Your account has to be more experienced than mine about 4,000 hours. I'm from my mom. I'm doing okay, but I'm playing Master Duel. <laughs> I did complain at the start of the stream that we don't have a new copy pasta, but you're still like kind of hinting at one specific individual, so I don't know. I mean, I guess it could be relevant to me, right? I'm from my mom, by the way. Okay, I guess we can mark story time off of this. My school... I don't know if that's a common thing or not. But my school... Had a school anthem... That we had to learn. 
that my our um, vice principal wrote. Do I wait? Maybe I just normal. The problem is like it's very likely that it's sprite starter, right? I mean, it could be imperms too. But yeah, anyways, we had um we had a school anthem and we all had to learn it and we all had to sing it on like special occasions and whatnot. And um it had a lyric that was like school I am coming slash hailing, you know, I am from you. And I remember, like, the 10-year-old me was, was like, Man, this shit's stupid. I'm from my mom, not from my school. Sing it? No, I won't. <laughs> I do vaguely remember it though. God damn, it was so corny though. And then like, it had lyrics where it's like... <laughs> it was referring to the color of the school building. And then they... Recolored the school. So it wasn't even accurate anymore. Is it on YouTube? I hope not. Yeah, freaking damn it. I hate that I was forced to play into Maxi or I lose. That's so unlucky. I'm I mean, I don't know, maybe they did later, but... They didn't like color it in one color, they <laughs> made it freaking mesh. Like it was it was in one color. To be fair, it was like a very bad color, but they, they tried to poetically link liken it to like specific flowers or something. But yeah, afterwards they, they made had this like really ugly paint job that a lot of schools had, I think. Where it had like a bunch of color blotches all over it. Looked disgusting. Wait. The wedding. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, never mind. Bat chest, Batman chest, no of course you have another two summons so you can just never run out, man, like, like it wouldn't have been a problem if you didn't open triple set, obviously it's probably gonna be attack boost plus the plus the starter and the one imperm or something, but like that's still crazy. Or potentially the banish. It's like one to two negates alongside. Or not negate, but interactions alongside that. Man. Oh wow. 
Didn't draw the out, unlucky dude. I think I'll go for like one more loss and then call it. Oh my god, it's later than I thought. We've been at it for like seven hours. Yeah, that's true. It's like, ugh. Freaking stupid design approach. Like, ah yes, a level. That is so specific and definitely not at all potentially problematic. Just at level two, yeah, that's great. Oh well. It happens. No point in getting upset about it. Can't let it ruin our mood. Mm. Oh, well, uh, this can be problematic as well. Yikes. I think we're probably going to be calling it, huh? Field spell setup is already so hard to deal with. Her. Oh wait, actually I can get rid of the field spell. I mean, it's not that bad actually. Might be fine. I already have a field spell. I do have a dead card in hand as well, which sucks, but I'm a Ruka player and Master Duel as well. Okay, quite. A little bit rude. <laughs> That's a little bit rude, isn't it? Hate him. That's me. Yeah, that's a lot of gnomes. <laughs> too late for me to impersonate them. Day cycle. You know, as long as you guys are enjoying them, keep gnoming for I hate how Twitch added like this um, this uh, warning system or whatever for ads. Like, oh, ads will begin in 10 minutes, which is from the ad manager thing. And you can snooze from the chat, which I thought was really cool, but it only appears like once, one or two times in the entirety of the stream. Even though ads automatically run like once every hour, right? Time. So... It doesn't actually give me the information I need. Most of the time I can't see it, it just says, Oh, ads are running. People will be back in a minute. Oh wow, it's... Thanks for letting me know, I guess. At least I know. Monkeys, don't worry about it. And I was basic combo. Uh oh. <laughs> Bruh. Unlucky for me.
Okay, this guy took longer than the dragon link dude. What's he doing? Where are we at? <laughs> Where have we ended up so far? What do we have? We have a princess in the grave, we have a field spell, I assume we will have the trap as well. Great that he still has like five minutes. <laughs> Bro, yeah, it's, I'm looking at the board. I'm like, this guy only has gotten to freaking the regular so far. Okay. Well, if they were better players, it would take them less time. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, he's already gone through my gallant suit, though. Okay. Oh, that's really annoying. Or maybe not. Oh my f- I mean, what's he gonna draw? A freaking plant? Come on, put it up. Come on, put it up. Come 
come on. Put it up. Put it up. He's got the peas. I mean, this would be significantly less freaking hecked if, you know, I had one less dead card in my hand. I can't play through the trap because I couldn't get rid of everything because of the float. Um, he's even like blind shooting it. Are you freaking kidding me? I have two cards in hand. Like in theory. It could be fricked though. I mean, I guess it depends on the card he has, right? That's actually so stupid though. I mean, obviously Ash Blossom is still a thing, right? But... I'm just rewarded for blindly activating and for me breaking. While he opens full combo and then some. It wasn't Droplet, so it was called by the Great Face Down or a Bluff. Great. That's great. Man, I mean, it happens, right? Just kind of upsetting because for some reason he gets to be lucky. Not just once, but twice, like... Not just the fact that he opens full combo, but also the fact that... I open... Not... That great. I mean, I guess the double lava was still pretty good, yeah. I don't know, maybe I'm being un unreasonable. But... Mm, it depends, like, he summoned on side, right? So it was potentially forcible, so if I had three good... Pens in hand instead of, alongside a field spell with one Lava Golem would have been enough. Also, not tributing Strena, who is also on the side. Yeah. Well, I guess he would have yanked with the trap immediately, though, if I didn't tribute it. Yeah. <sighs> so unlucky, but I mean, it is what it is, right? It happens. Uh, we went for longer than I intended though, so I'm gonna call it here. Thanks for hanging on, guys. Uh, tomorrow, I don't know, some other decks for the event, probably. I need to make a VOD command. What the frick? I typed Nifroth VODs in Google and it gave me Nifty50. The Nifty 50 is a benchmark Indian stock market index that, rep index that represents the weight average of, f the f of 50 of the largest Indian companies listed on the Nish National Stock Exchange. Nifty 50 is owned and managed by NSE Indices, which is a wholly owned subs subsidiary of the NSE Strategic Investment Corporation Limited. Alright guys, maybe because we have like, well, I don't know, to be fair, I don't want people to sub if you don't care to watch the VODs, but, you know, in case you want to watch the VODs, wait, this link sucks, it's not that. Does this work? It does, yeah, okay. There you go, in case. But, you know, don't sub to it if you don't want to watch them because subs that don't click on it when they see it are uh, considered, like, I don't know, bad or whatever. Uh, Nifty 50, yep. Um, where 
where do we go? Boop, boop. Is there anyone mom that we haven't traded list right now? That's I see a couple options. Can I read Nifrov? No, I hit that guy. Alright, well... Oh my god, is that a pack opening? That's perfect. That's perfect. I'm gonna send you guys over to Laura. A very positive, happy individual opening packs right now. Got who you are. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, I'll uh, <laughs> I'll see y'all tomorrow. I'll do a bit more event and probably try to push the master thing more. I mean, I don't know. Today I didn't mind the event, but I don't know. Maybe tomorrow will be fixed matchmaking. That's also possible. Don't raid Mango. No. It's too late. I'm already raiding Mango. If you want the raid message, high smile. It's always a classic, you know. But if you are too shy or don't feel like it, that's also fine. Alright, bye-bye. Have a good one.